Oh boy, folks. It's Pokemon Emerald time. Okay. Now that we've watched that together. Can we get some friggin' like, just like some friggin' I don't know, some hype in the chat? the coolest real Game Boy I've ever seen. Yeah, same. Three months in the bag That's what you got You know I appreciate it Thank you a lot Hey, thanks buddy. Welcome back, Patches. Appreciate it. Uh, sorry, can we, can we get more hype? Just because the... <laughs> The notification for that covered up the chat or or just like like let's go like that kind of stuff. You know, you know what I'm doing. I'm trying to take a screenshot for Twitter. I'm gonna post it on Twitter. Hell yeah. All right. All right, people being nice and posting Twitter in the chat, getting gotta get their special thing in there. I'm gonna go out of my way to black out uh you saying Twitter, Jack Bones. <laughs> you will not get the recognition for not doing the thing that I asked. I can't I can't have it. I just can't have it. I can't reward that type of behavior. All right. Let's go over to Twitter, folks. <sighs> Here we go. Uh, rules. Uh, All right, twitch.tv slash Phil Jameson. We're getting it going. Subs. Great. Thank you very much, Temperani. Appreciate it for the five gift subs. And hey, Temperani, how you doing? Uh, hi, everyone. I'm streaming this game. If my Pokemon faint, I have to send them to hell. See you soon. Or, or not see you soon, because that implies I'm not live. All right. See ya. Let's do it, guys. Let's go find out who we're uh, playing, who our teammate is. <sighs> oh, yeah. my On my Game Boy, my internal battery ran dry, so. Uh, Clock-based events are not going to occur. So that's, that's on me, guys. Is it off the top of the screen there? I think it is. Oh, I have a crop on my window capture, don't I? I have a crop on my window capture. I must. Yeah, let's get rid of that. All right, there we go. Here we go, folks. It begins Pokemon Emerald. This guy. I fully expected to see Professor Oak, and I forgot that it is not indeed Professor Oak in this game. His name's Birch. This is what we call a Pokemon. It's an Altaria, folks. Uh, at times as friendly playmates, and at times as cooperative workmates. Uh, I'm not going to mention when we have them fight to the death. Uh, we band together and battles others like... Uh, oh, yeah, he's going to mention it. Never mind. We don't know everything about Pokemon. Many secrets surrounding Pokemon. Unravel their mysteries. I've been undertaking research. That's what I do. And you are? All right. What... Is my name. I assume it's just Phil, and I'm battling against chat again, right? Phil 2? 
So yeah, you guys get to just a just a quick rehash if you weren't here for the first run. You get to name all the Pokemon we catch. All of the Pokemon have to be named, and you get to name them based on like just pitching names and chat and stuff. Greg Geraldo, Fibby, Gil, Bodega. Are we are we giving myself a like joke name? Or are we just calling Phil Sequel? Phil Sequel doesn't fit. There's only seven letters total. Phil. Alright. No no other one really picked up any steam, so. Sequel? Okay, a couple sequels picked up a couple. Sequel, Phil. Phil Jr. Okay, Phil Jr. Phil or sequel? Phil, Phil Jr., Phil Jr., Phil Jr.? This is Phil's son. I think, uh, Phil Jr., Phil. Phil, Phil Jr., Fequel, 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 got fe a few Fequels. Fequel? Oh my god. My name is Fequel? That's, it doesn't sound like the word sequel. It sounds like the word fecal. So I'm gonna have to slam my hand down on the buzzer of vetoing fecal. Um, gonna veto the one that sounds like poop. Uh, but thank you uh, for the pitch. I appreciate it. It is clever. Uh, veto button has been jammed and it looks like it's gonna be Phil Jr. Phil Jr. versus Phil are really the last two that are surviving here. So get in the chat which one you want right now. It's the last chance to name the character. Looks like Junior's winning. All right. So it's Phil Junior? Sure is. PJ. Oh, you're Phil Jr. who's moving to my hometown of Litteru. What a coincidence. I get it now. Oh, this is going to be so hard. Guys, it's all random. I don't know what I'm... If you didn't see the last one, let me just tell you, it's very random. This game is so random. Oh yeah, you start in a truck in this one. You have to work as a mover for about five months before you get to start playing the game. <laughs> okay. Phil Jr., we're here, honey. Must be tiring riding with our things in the moving truck. Well, this is Little Root Town. How do you like it? It's our new home. It has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? I don't know. I've been in a truck. I just stepped out of the truck. So I don't know if it seems to be an easy place to live. You get your own room. Oh, <laughs> Oh yeah, baby! Oh, they, we got friggin' moving company Vigoroths, dude. All right, my dad is in this game, dude. Which means, which doesn't make sense because if I'm Phil Jr., then all right. Well, let's go to bed. Good night, everybody. All right, thanks for watching the Nuzlocke run, guys. We beat the game. We went to bed. Uh, okay. What do you say? Go to your computer. Withdraw that posh. Got a potion there. <laughs> G, 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 G. Uh, set the clock, right? Which I can't do, right? All right. 2.30, huh? This was really cool. I remember clock-based events. Those started in uh, silver, right? Silver gold. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Is this correct time? Sure is. Everything's put away neatly. Oh my god, Pokemon movers are so convenient. <laughs> Unlike regular movers who just don't know what they're doing. People are so dumb, dude. Oh, the TV! That's right, the TV! There's like a TV in this one where you get to like see events that are happening in the world. It's cool. Professor Birch. Go introduce yourself to Professor Birch. Do they pay Pokemon workers? Definitely not, Trash. 
Total slave labor situation. Uh, but they do the propaganda where they say that the Pokemon like to do it, so. Uh, Nazak rules right away. Or, uh, yeah, so if we lose the battle with our rival, we have to restart. And we have to redo a, a get a new roll. Is the professor Jeff Bezos? I don't think so. It's Jeff Burchos. Uh, you can't go there. Oh, wait, what? I thought... Okay. Dude, I can't even play this kid's game. I'm too stupid for it. <laughs> I, I didn't read enough. A superhero show or something? There might be. I like that this woman, when I walked into her home, was like, Uh, who are you? Because that doesn't happen in any other... Oh, give me this freaking Pokemon, dude. What are you doing? Nay, glad to meet you. I have this dream of becoming friends with Pokemon all over the world. I heard about you, Phil Jr. from my dad, Professor Birch. I was hoping that you would be nice, and we could be friends. Oh, this is silly. Uh, I, I've just met you. Uh, 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 oh, oh, no, I forgot. Uh, I was supposed to go help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. What's this? Better leave it right where it is. All right. See what we got here, folks. Oh, he's getting frickin' owned by this zigzagoon, dude. Help! There's a Pokeball. All right, folks. We could cat. Oh, my lord. Bulbasaur, Caterpie, or Wizmer. I mean... We can start with Bulbasaur, dude. It's definitely the correct choice. It He's literally number one. It's definitely the correct choice. However, I am a little bit leaning towards Wismer. <laughs> I'm not taking Caterpie, guys. It's that's a lost cause. Caterpie's dog shit. Uh. Uh. Wismer is also very good because I love it. You lose the fight instantly. It's true. I'll probably just lose. All right, we'll take Bulbasaur. We gotta take Bulbasaur. It's not really an option. It's just I wish it were. All right. Uh, do you choose this Pokemon? Yes, dude. I choose the friggin' Bulbasaur. All right. We'll be pitching names very briefly. Quick Attack and Acid, all right. I'll take freaking Quick Attack and Acid. That's a great starting move set. Uh, remember, I've done a uh, reorder. I thought he was gonna hit five and crit me. Um. On the level two Zigzagoon. Uh, okay. So, uh, the moves that I've chosen um, are random. They prefer type. So they prefer the type the Pokemon is. And you learn the weaker moves before you learn the stronger moves. Those are the rules that I'm playing with. Uh, so that's why it's acid and quick attack instead of like hyper beam and sludge bomb or whatever. Ah, oh, you got your father's blood in your veins. You use that level five Bulbasaur to beat that level two Zigzagoon narrowly. I'd like you to have the Pokemon user earlier. Hell yeah, baby! Why not give a nickname to that Bulbasaur? Folks, it's time to pop off in the chat. What is Bulbasaur's nickname? All right, let's see what we got here. Name him Boba Sore. Sour Eggs. Uh, Buddy Sore. Bulby, Bulb Freak. Bulb. Buddy Sore. Uh, Onion Frog. Bubba. Bulba Fett. 
Greenman, Burbasaur. All right, we got to so, so typically how we do it is everybody pitches their names out. Uh, if nobody's picked up on your name, maybe try to get on board with something else you like, and then it'll we'll try to get it down to like one or two, and then Bulba Fett people start to like. Buddy Sore and Bulba Fett seem to be the leaders right now. Buddy Sore or Bulba Fett? Bulba Fett's a dominant winner. Folks, our starting Pokemon, a Bulbasaur named Bulba Fett. If you work at Pokemon and gain experience, I think you'll make an extremely good trainer. My kid, May, is also studying Pokemon while helping me out. Don't you think it might be a good idea to go see May? Sure. Teach what it means to be a trainer. Star Wars bad. <laughs> Alright, all right, we're, we're low health, right? Oh no, he healed me. He silently healed me, dude. Alright. What's up, May? Are we about to fight, dude? I don't remember how Emerald works. What? This is messed up, dude. Where's May? Route 103, right. Okay. So you don't have an immediate rival battle in this one. So that's actually a little easier. Uh. All right, me and Bulba Fett, dude. Heading out. So, uh, since we don't have Pokeballs yet, um, any Pokemon we encounter right now does not count as, like, the one that we can catch on this route. Um, is this guy a trainer? Oh, okay. So now we'll find out what we will actually be able to find on this route. It's a slow poke, folks. Wouldn't be bad, wouldn't be bad. Her starter will be level 7 or maybe level 8 because of my... So I increased the scaling on, uh, on, uh, the levels, so... Ooh, not very good. Slowpoke, I love him. Well, we can't catch him yet, so. I forget uh, if he's psychic. He's not, that's right. Uh, his psychic baton pass, his psychic typing got stolen by, what's his face? Odds on Jirachi 2 are pretty much 0% uh, accurate unless I get it through a trade or get it through uh, another static Pokemon. Wow. A lot of encounters so far. Electrike. Okay. This is a pretty straightforward, like, Route 1 thing. Like, this is, you know, Electrike and slow Slowpoke. Those are, like, almost kind of like, oh, wow. What is with these two to five level attacks that do three damage per hit? Electrike with Ice Spike, dude. Uh, yeah, no random legendaries in the wild this time. I, I checked a box that said, can't happen. Alright, so sh I know she's not level 5 when we get to her. However, I'm, like, I'm not gonna go out of my way to train. I don't think I'm gonna do, like, a rule of, like, you can't kill any wild Pokemon or anything like that. But I'm not going to go way out of my way to train. I don't think I want to do that. Um, I'm going to make it like a little bit tougher. By the time we get to the Elite Four, I'll probably have to just because of the scaling. But everybody survived in the uh, uh, against the Elite Four. Wait, you can't buy Pokemon, ball, po Pokemon balls. Come on, Phil. All right, let's see, let's see what's on this route. I'm very glad he's level two. Uh, he's ground uh, psychic with really high defense. Okay, that's a good crit. It's good to see because At least it's not ghost. Yeah, well, poison would hit ghost, but. Oh, 
Oh, Boba Fett did. Only Pokemon from Gen 1, 2, and 3. Yes, correct. Sleep Powder, dude. What a classic early level grass type move. Might even be something he actually learns. Gotta go heal already. Boba Fett's little uh, sprite. Yeah, I love the sprites in these games. Pixel art's so good. Wait, it's Tallboy Senior. It was Tallboy Senior. Sleep Powder don't miss. I wish it don't miss. It do miss. It will come in handy, hopefully, if I survive this. Uh... Chances if May hasn't got a Charizard. Oh, my lord. Oh, no! Am I allowed to run from these battles? I guess so, right? It's cowardly, but I'm not going to win this fight. All right, question is, am I allowed to run from uh, wild battles? Why wouldn't you be? Just our, our own rules, really. Yeah. Run from uh, battles, but not from my love. I think you should be able to run. Okay, cool. We'll try. All right, we made it. Yeah, well, I can't. I can't catch right now anyway, because I don't have pokeballs. Should have brought a potion, dude. Amateur hour. All right, we're not over training for May. Ah, oh, boy. All right. Skill swap. Anything but skill swap, dude. All right. I mean, I'm not like going out of my way, Deffy. Come on. Come on. All right. Good luck to us. Spinda! Spinda, folks. This won't be a problem. It's just a Spinda. Can't go wrong here. Just kill the Spinda real quick. Constrict, okay. Can't be a problem here. Not worried. I don't remember if I checked, uh, if I checked, uh, keeps their thing throughout the game. I don't remember if I checked that. The rest of her Pokemon will. I think I know why my dad has an eye out for you now. She's got that Pokemon, but it already likes you. i be able to befriend any kind of Pokemon easily. Well, see you later. All right. One down, folks. We've survived our first obstacle. Uh, yes, correct, Dunk. It's a close one. Absolutely, utterly be. Very weird that Spinda does not evolve. Very, very weird. Sorry, home. Do you give me a potion, man, from the shop? Ah. Potion! I love a good promotional item. Promotional potion. Proportional item. I thought for so long Spin evolved into Earth Ring. That's a very rational thing to think. It's a very rational thing to think. I totally understand that. 
That's great. I thought that she was going to have a higher level Pokemon, not a level 5 Pokemon. I got something for you too. Pokeballs! It begins, folks. It does, Freddy. Here's literal medicine. Take it as a promotion, kiddo. Hey, Mom. Did you introduce yourself? You want to give me some shoes? I love to put a zip in my step, dude. This is a much better uh, promotional item. I love when the dialogue says, like, press B. I think that's so funny. Deuces. All right, folks. You think it's going to be an Electrike or a Slowpoke that we end up with? Also, do you think it can survive a quick attack from level 8 Bulbasaur? I don't know if it can. I think we just Sleep Powder it. Good luck to us, folks. This is the only Pokemon we can catch. The first Pokemon that we encounter in the game that we can catch is an Electrike, folks. Level 3 Electrike. So we're going to go ahead and put that to sleep. Press B to pet my cat. <laughs> okay. Pokeball, folks. Pokemon. Yeah, that's how I say it. Uh, Pokemon or Pokemon. One of the two. I, I think I usually say Pokemon. Well... Okay, so if that does all five hits, it's going to be 15 damage. <sighs> and if it crits, I'll die. Um, but I think we just have to take the risk. Do you think I quick attack? It's level three. I think it'll survive a quick attack. I think I quick attack it. Good luck to us. I'm so smart, dude. It wasn't an insta catch. I already threw one EXO. It broke out immediately. First catch of the game, baby! Electrike, folks, with Icicle Spear. Thank you very much, Dunk. What is Electrike's nickname? It generates electricity using friction from the atmosphere. In seasons with especially arid air, its entire body blazes with violent showers of sparks. It's true. Uh, give a nickname to the captured Electrike. Uh, Susan. Hey, Chat Senior. Sparky. Static. Got multiple Susans, multiple Sparkies, Spark Bark. Sparky and Susan just had a very quick lead. Spark Bark is, uh, we have a couple of Spark Barks, Susans. Susan has a very strong lead right now, but Spark Bark is picking up a little bit. Spark Bark has taken like a, a strong position here. Spark Bark is leading, Spark Bark is going hard, Spark Bark. Electric named Spark Bark, folks. Spark Bark has strong beak freak energy. It really does. Spark Bark's sleeping. Taking a little nap. Spark Bark has only Icicle Spear. The only move is Icicle Spear. Okay. Susan Sparkbark Electric is the name. The official name. Alright. I miss Beak Freak, same. Oh yeah, that's that same type of attack bonus on that icicle spirited. Alright, we're gonna go see if we can get a clay doll, dude. 
An early clay doll. That would be pretty cool. Uh, if we hit a camera up, it's going to be tough, but... Oh, let me buy a couple more, actually, because we only got three Pokeballs, and that might not be enough. Oh, what a jam, dude. Uh, Ball Toy evolves to Clay Doll. Alright, folks. The only Pokemon we can catch on Route 103 is... Oh, not ideal, not ideal. Okay, we're going to try to put him to sleep. Naming it Lemeth. It's not bad. It's just, it's good against Boba Fett, uh, is the problem. Both will be ineffective, but Acid will do a little more damage. Name this one Lime. It would be justice for how you treated Lemon, to be fair. It would. Oh, Mega Drain! <laughs> Oh, what a relief, dude. He wakes up, he uses Mega Drain. Oh, this guy's a lemon, too. Absolute lemon. A new Nuzlocke Spirit. Our starter Pokemon named Bulba Fett. All right, that should be in range to catch. Uh, this one's going to be harder for a number of reasons, but. The catch rate is 100%, Bailey. Ba-boom! We've caught Camerupt. A Pokemon that lives in the crater of a volcano. Every 10 years, the volcanoes on its back erupt violently. How long does it live? That you know every 10 years, the volcanoes erupt violently. This thing is lives a long time. Research is underway on the cause of eruption. All right, lemon, lime, lumpy, twin peaks. Camelback. That's what you got. You know I appreciate it. Thank you a lot. Hey, thank you very much, Lumpur. Welcome back for three months. Twin Peaks seems to be leading. Twin Peaks is a, a violent winner. Twin Peaks, folks. All right, check out our team, folks. We've got Bulba Fett. We've got uh, Spark Bark, the Electric, and we have Twin Peaks, the Camerupt, holding a Rostberry. Twin Peaks is a decent Pokemon right now. Twin Peaks has better stats than the Electric by a mile because it's evolved. It's got Will-O-Wisp, Fire Spin, Mega Drain, and Fury Attack. I mean potentially useful potentially useful folks all right and it uses mega drain on me yeah could have gone very differently yeah fire spin would not have been great it wouldn't have been lethal on hit because it's only it's pretty weak but uh it might not have been good uh all right, so in this grass, there's Electric and... Oh, yeah, Twin Peaks can... Well, if the if the, if the the Slowpoke has a water attack, then it might kill Twin Peaks in one hit, right? Double super effective against Rock Fire. Uh, 
Remember when Lemon wanted to be on the team so badly it evolved itself and jumped games? Oh, it's ground fire? Okay. Yeah, so so water would be good against it. Uh, it'll kill electrics, right? Well, it might not even kill the electric, right? Man. Fire spin is uh, not an ideal move. I guess maybe we just put him in and switch him out if it's a if it's a slowpoke. Icicle spear should not be too much of a threat to to him. Sink or swim. On some level, Uzel, I agree with you. If you can't if you can't beat an unevolved Pokemon same level, uh, fire spin. Let's go, baby. Hit him. Okay. Let's see what we got. Crit. Okay, so it only does one damage if it doesn't crit. Might take a little while, but we got it. Uh, it can only do up to 10, uh, maybe a little more, but we're going to Fury attack it. All right. It really does look like two volcanoes. Three. Okay, hit me three times. Hurt by fire spin. Okay, so one more hit will kill it, so we'll go Mega Drain. First possible opportunity for static to activate. All right. All right. Twin Peaks survived a fight. And did level up. And got some decent stats, actually. That's pretty decent stats. S swim. Swim. Totally swam. Totally swam. That's my peak, freak. <laughs> Alright. Uh, now... It's Spark Bark's turn. Dude, Spark Bark, I don't know how we're gonna possibly train Spark Bark. It has Icicle Spear. It's level three. I can't put it in against the, against the, I guess we just go up. I don't know, dude. I don't know how to train the, do we just go to the next area and catch another Pokemon and say maybe we're gonna get rid of Spark Bark? Okay, let's uh, let's let's try to catch another Pokemon. Next route, folks. Only Pokemon we can catch on this route. That's not a trainer, is it? Yeah. Okay. Only Pokemon we can catch on this route is a Wall Rain. Yo! Sleep Powder, baby! Uh, huge if we don't die to him. Alright. Um, guys, I'm very worried. I don't think potion is the move, Lady Up, because if it hits five times, he dies, and I lose the potion, and then we're toast. I don't know if running is the move. Oh, I don't try to catch? What are you, out of your mind? So, 
sleep is a three out of four chance to survive it. He might only have ice. Yeah. If we go to Twin Peaks, uh, he'll be neutrally effective. Uh... Oh, okay, so let's take a look here. That noise, that noise, dude. It, it, it shuts down every uh, mental processing I have, piece of mental processing I have. Uh, is, is Icicle Spear physical? Oh, it, does this game not have it yet? This game does not have it yet. Does it? Are all ice moves special in this game? Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, this game doesn't have that. Uh... Oh, I'm glad to hear that, Space Cat. We're about to have everybody die to a wild Pokemon. Um... <laughs> we gotta take a risk. We gotta... We, we can't... We can't flee from a level 3 Pokemon. No, we can't do that. Because if, if we encounter, like, a Wall Rain, a trainer... It's just like... We can't we can't live like cowards. We have to give our our people a chance to succeed. How is he critting? This guy's critting like a maniac, dude. That's two crits in two moves. I'm in a will o wisp. What's up, waxing cats? <laughs> nah, guys, you know, we can't, we can't let him do it. He can't keep getting away with this. He can't keep getting away with this. Use spark bark, all right. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're using a potion on Bulba Fett. Oh, we're not bailing. Oh, ball, okay, cool, 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 cool. Oh, we gotta catch him. We have to prevent this murderer from murdering anyone else. We can't even, all right, we're going for the, <laughs> we're going for the fucking two thirds health catch on Walrein, dude. All in, baby. Oh! Okay. Premier Ball's the same rate. We're going all in on this, dude. We're going 100% all in on Walrein. Stop, stop getting these rolls, dude. What are these rolls? All right. Okay, so we're gonna switch. <laughs> we're gonna switch to Bulb. We're gonna switch to Bulb of Fat. Hoping he uses reversal here. Stop! Okay. Sleep powder. No! No! Okay. Okay. No, we, we're going sleep powder. We've only got one potion left. Okay, we hit it. Okay.
We need him to sleep for two more turns. We're potioning right now. Are we out of potions? No, we got one more potion. All in. We're going all in on wall rain, baby. Acid, he'll go to like one HP. Woke up. Octazuka, nice, 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 nice. Cr Stop critting me! Okay. We're in the danger zone, unfortunately, but we gotta go sleep powder. Okay. <sighs> I'm going to catch you, Walrein. You will be my Pokemon. Okay. Premier ball, baby. I love how Bulba Fett looks just like kind of bored. <sighs> oh. Oh. Fell asleep again. Fast asleep again. This is the one. This is the one, baby. Yeah. Yeah. Warren is villain monologuing with Octazuka. <laughs> yes, dude! We got him! We got him, baby! Yeah! Oh, hell yeah, baby! Nice. Nice. Thank you, Akron Rat. To protect its herd, the leader battles anything that invades its territory, even at the cost of its life. Its tusks may snap off in battle. What? Okay. That was a weird end to that. Uh, give a nickname to the captured wall rain, folks. Murderer, does that fit? Is murderer what we're doing? Tusky boy, t twin troughs, murderer, sacrifice, murderer, 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 murderer. All right. Hands down, he will never forget what he done. Murderer. Friggin' herderer, too, because it protects its herd, dude. All right, let's go to the frickin' uh, Pokemon Center. Heal folks up. Thank you, Temporani. I appreciate that. It was a good joke. Really, I shouldn't have healed first, but uh, <laughs> nice, Vangers. Let's go ahead and open up this here PC. And go to the party Pokemon and Twin Peaks. Goes to box 14. Of course, the wallpaper for box 14 will have to be a volcano. And the name of this box will indeed be hell. Sure, we could take uh, we could take the berry off. Take that berry out of hell. Hell will be okay with him. I don't think it's really hell. Uh, that's where you're wrong. These Pokemon die. All right, murderer, folks. Thick fat, very good. Reversal, inflicts more damage when the user's HP is down. Icicle Spear, Powder Snow, and Octazooka. Pretty solid little kit there. And we're gonna go level up murderer a couple times. Suffer for eternity and you take their berry, yeah. Which, which by the way, if I remember correctly, heals from burns. <laughs> so it's just like extra cruel. Send him to hell and take his berry that heals him from burns. 
All right, so this guy only has uh, Icicle Spear, so we're good on that. We're gonna go ahead and use, uh, what's better, Icicle Spear? No, Powder Snow's probably better. Murderer will become a mass murderer with those moves. Yeah, seriously. Twin Peaks is in a better place for them. Electric with the frickin' Icicle Spear 5 hit here. Okay, 4 hit. Sorry about the murder, Phil. Hey, sometimes you gotta risk it to get the wall rain on your team. Everybody's telling me to run. I'll take a wall rain over a uh, camera up every day of the week. All right, level two slowpoke. Level three murderer. I guess we'll use reversal, even though it's almost full health. Let's see how much it does. Oh, nothing. It doesn't do anything at all. Baton pass. I think we could survive a bata baton pass. Uh, we're going to go for Icicle Spear because it's probably not going to do very much damage, but it'll do it five times up to. This might just be a switch to get someone else in there. Round. Slowpoke's trying desperately to pass a baton to someone, but there's no one there. Uh, let's see what, how much Octazuka does. A little better. Very relatable. Oh, this poor slowpoke, dude. I feel bad for this slowpoke. It's like, uh, baton pass? Uh, bubble? <laughs> Got Whirlpool. Whirlpool's a little better. Sorry, buddy. Four HP for that level. Already four HP for a level up. Such a good Pokemon, Slowbro too. I guess I could put. Uh, I could I could train Walrein on additional camera ups, right? And if it's Clay Doll, I'll switch to. I'll switch to what's his face. Oh, dear! All right, we're gonna switch because fighting is good against uh, ice. Did not realize this was on this route. It's a question mark at this point, folks. Yeah, Harry on animation is scary. Low cook that would have been very good against Walrein. Does more damage against high weight characters, and it would have been super effective. So that would have been bad. Oh! Oh! Oh my god. Oh my lord. Jesus Christ. Come on, Bulba Fett, dude. My lord. These narrow escapes. I should have gone with Caterpie. Phil, I wanted this run to be a little harder, Dreamus. <laughs> oh, I got my wish. I got my wish. Boba, said, Boba Fett said not today. Yeah, but the thing about that is I can't really train on that route because if I go back with Bulbasaur and use Acid again, it'll probably kill me, the counter, because he, he uh, leveled up. Dude, Spark Bark is just getting left by the wayside right now. Okay, we'll get... The thing is, like, one trainer that has, like, a level 8 Pokemon that's good is going to wipe us. Yeah, counter is... And he's got high HP, too, so it's not like I could just get really strong really quick. Oh, I didn't even know that didn't have 100%. What do we say to the God of Death? 
Let's put Murderer out there. If he dies, he dies. Wow, Lady Yuck, damn. Some hate for the wall rain, huh? You like Lemon too that much? Counter has caused many Nuzlocke deaths for me. Yeah, I mean, it's... Electrike's really trying. Murderer is part of the Su Suicide Squad. <laughs> That's basically what it is. All right. 44 experience, nice. Another four, exp no, four HP there, a couple more defense. Important. <clears throat> good, 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 good. Cheers, Duffy. This should one hit now. Big. Big moment for Murderer. And another big moment just afterwards. Another two special attack. Bubble Beam already, folks. Murderer is killing it right now. 65, 100, or 65, 85. It's going to be 65, 100 over the 65, 85. Unless this is two to five in a row, which is almost always worse than Powder Snow. We might get rid of... Uh, Powder Snow and or get rid of Icicle Spear instead of uh, Octazuka. It'll be nice to have Reversal available to us. Uh, Icicle Spear is a lot of PP, but so is Powder Snow. It's 25. Powder Snow is such a mood setter, though. Um, why would you need Octazuka? Yeah, only if I'm lowering, if I need to lower someone's accuracy. We'll get rid of Octazuka. It's just that Icicle Spear sucks. Uh, so it's gonna be going soon. Powder Snow can freeze, yes, exactly. So Powder Snow is is almost strictly better. There's a very small chance that uh, Icicle Spear could be better in some situation, but All right, let's get Spark Bark a level as well. Uh, yeah, but utterly be Powder Snow would come in bigger on crits, right? Because it would just be one crit to to boost the whole attack. I don't think we just take this straight up, right? I don't think we can do that. There's no there's no reason we would win. I just realized I swapped in someone who will take more damage from it, but we'll be all right. Everybody's getting some experience on this one. Uh, actually, we'll probably be fine. 15 damage without a crit. With a crit, it'll be 21 damage, so we're in good shape. If it's if it's all five hits, also. So. All right, and quick attack will finish the job. Uh, I didn't really set that rule, Dunk. I said, like, I'm not going crazy with it. Right? Being being level, you know, 6 or whatever, <laughs> going into permanent death where they could have any Pokemon is tough. What's up, Hitchhiker Hobbit? Oh, it's going great, bud. We, we just started our uh, Nuzlocke run. This was our starter. Um... Nice Bulbasaur. Somehow. Uh, even though it's random. I can't just go... Oh, up. Uh, we've got a Wall Rain as well. Level 7. And a Spark Bark. An Electrike. Uh, here as well. So we're doing alright. We're doing alright. Watching while doing something. Uh, making a joke about the swapping. Not trying to call out for a bit of grinding. Oh, word, word. Uh, okay. <sighs> Next route. Go back to... Do we? I mean, it's it's gonna be a wall rain or something else. Wall rain will be fine against wall rain, but uh, boy, it's hard to use our Bulbasaur when we have a wall rain. You know, wall rain is gentle for some reason. Gently killed Twin Peaks, <laughs> shaking my head. I guess wall rain can train on that top route now, right? If it's a Hariyama. I don't know. Wall rain versus wall rain. Whose rain will continue? 
and whose will end? Find out on this episode of Walrein vs. Walrein. Um, I think I have to do Powder Snow first here, and then use my last uh, Bubble Beam, because if I get him to 1 HP and then he uses Reversal, I think we die. Are these the Walrein? Our Walrein we're protecting like his herd? I think I think so, and now Walrein's being sent back to finish the job. I don't think that did enough. Uh-oh, okay. We're probably fine. Oh, we're, we're more than fine. We're gonna do another Powder Snow to get him just like a shade lower, and then, boom. We should be good with a, with a Bubble Beam here. They both got large tusk, Lady Up. It would really stink if he was, uh, if, if we brought this wall rain down to one HP and he used reversal. Oh. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Phil. Now I have to believe in the secret. <laughs> My lord, the number of times we've already almost like had major losses is absurd. And the one major loss we did have. Uh, I mean, I think Sparkbark's just gonna eat shit this run. I don't, I, like, I don't think. Uh, we're gonna go back up here. We're gonna get one more level and then we're moving on out, fighting some trainers. Don't be a Hariyama. Just don't be a Hariyama. Okay, good. The best episode of Walrein vs. Walrein yet. Alright. Rematch! We'll just never know what other moves Electric might learn. Yeah, it's tough to use Electric with Icicle Spear. <laughs> just, just like a constrict level bad move. Murderer is very good against Camerupt. Very good type advantage against Camerupt by Murderer. Alright. All right, so we got a trainer here, folks. Good luck to us. Let's hope he doesn't have... Uh... Who, who do we hope he doesn't have? We hope he doesn't have, uh, like, a, a Regirock. That's who we hope this uh, youngster doesn't have. We could deal with an Ekans. We can deal with an Ekans. We're gonna be, uh... Come on, dead. Barrage. It's not a move you see too often. You can't say no to... Bro! You get one more shot, Bulbafet. Are you joking me? All right, you know what? No, we're going again. Bulbafet, buddy! Misses four sleep powders and almost dies to a level five Ekans, dude. Murderer is my new best friend. <laughs> Bubble beam. Murderer gets it. Murderer's like, step aside, Bulba Fett. Sounds like the trainer's fault. Performance anxiety. <laughs> Should have picked Caterpie. 
All right. Well, we beat our first trainer, folks. Big moment for us. Big moment for us. Yeah, we did do a setting for this run that uh, any any uh, Pokemon we used had to evolve twice. Uh, so it's not full random on this one. All right, second trainer. Boba Fett's chance to redeem themselves. Our eyes met. I talked to you on purpose, so of course our eyes met. A Chin Chow. Okay. We could take a Chin Chow. And we don't even really need to use Sleep Powder against a Chin Chow. We could just go for gold. Straight to gold. Having a conversation while avoiding eye contact to not have to battle a trainer. Yeah, they started with each other's... Uh... Actually, no, the starter for this was... Uh... What was the starter for this? Mudkip, right? Alright. That's big. Poison Fang is good. Uh, Abra might have a move like Psychic, so we're gonna switch. If Abra just happened into, like, a powerful Psychic move, that would have been a problem. It's not time for Spark Bark, dude. Spark Bark has had its shot. What's up, King Meta Comet? Bug Catcher Rick Deuces, buddy. You're done. You're out. You're out of it. Fwa 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 chu. Bro, there's a pandemic on. Alright. Oh, yeah, you can plant, plant berries, dude. I forgot you could plant friggin' berries, dude. Am I seeing this mod drama? What? Du -du -du -du. All my homies love planting berries. I need to get that freaking watering can, dude. Feels like there would be an item here. But there's not. All right, good luck to us. Good luck, Bulba Fett. We're both beginners. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Oh no! Oh yikes, Pidgeotto! All right. Well, but Fett's not the one to do this. But you know who is? The man himself, murderer, coming on out to get some ice in the air, dude. Oh, I just realized we're playing on Switch. We need to switch that to set. I will, I will, uh... Good thing it is level three, buddy. Wow, okay. Good thing it's level three. Whew. I called you because I thought you, I could beat you. Well, sorry that I just murdered your friends. All right, uh, we're gonna go to option. We're gonna do tech speed fast and we're gonna go battle style set. All right, good luck. Excuse me? Did the text break when I s selected tech speed fast? Oh wow, Dugong. Is it meaning of life? That's a good question. Um, play in Pokemon. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and do Poison Fang. I think a level four Dugong versus a level 10 Bulbasaur will be okay. Curse, okay. 
Do we turn animations off there accidentally? What did we do? We we like There we go. Badly poisoned, baby. I didn't randomize trainer text, so. Last sent out nine tails. We know who's coming out against nine tails. Good thing we switched, because that's a mean look right there. Yeah, I'm gonna switch the tech speed back after this. Feels weird. Spark Bark's only got, uh, <laughs> only got Icicle Spear, so not gonna be coming out against that nine tails. Yeah, I don't like this tech speed. That's too much. It's too much. I get that that makes it faster, but we're going back. Let's save the game, dude. What's up, Insomniac? An honorable death. Our Pokemon were neat. They're corpses now. You're right. They are. All right, we're going to put Spark Bark out in front here. Found a charcoal, dude. It's a good item to find quickly. Uh, nobody's got any fire moves yet, but... Charcoal. Oh, uh, I can. Oh, uh, Insomniac. It would, it would be good against Houndor if I could uh, catch him. However, I cannot. Murderer, you're coming on out. Twin Peaks had fire moves. That's absolutely right. Sunny day. All right, Houndor. Let us have Houndor as a treat. Can't do it. Can't break the rules. Can't happen. Can't be done. All right, Spark Bark, time to hit level four, buddy. Time to get you level four. Just wanna have a nice day in the sun. It wasn't even trying to kill me. Just did sunny day. All right. Oh, another wall rain, folks. Funny thing is, Spark Bark, if, if Spark Bark were to get an electric move, we could take down wall rains with Spark Bark, but. The Hodor will never have you. Well. <laughs> Yeah, it's possible to encounter another one. You never know. It's all random, baby. Spark Bark! Grew to level four. Learn Thundershock! Do we try to let Spark Bark fight one? Same level. I feel like Spark Bark will probably die, but maybe won't. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at uh, nine special defense, 17 HP. I mean, <laughs> wrong opinion. We're gonna give Spark Bark a shot here real quick. Also, I'm gonna do something here real quick. Pop, okay, we're good. We're gonna give Spark Bark a shot here. Murder couldn't one-shot the wild Spark Bark, so yeah. It's true. Hey, what a, what a roll. What a roll for Spark Bark here. Spark Bark is just getting the good luck. This is a sign from the Spark Gods. It says, train this Spark Bark, dude. We like them. We like them and we want to see more of them. 
clamp. That's all right. You won't. Uh, wow. Okay. That was actually a little better than I thought it was going to be, but you're good, dude. You're good. You got him. Of course, I have to immediately go straight back to the <laughs> to the Pokemon Center now, but Spark Rock, Spark Rock just got green lighted by the gods. A little bit. Yeah. Two more special attack there. Nice. Nice. He evolves like level, some really weird level, right? Like level 32 or something. 28. I remember like a weird evolution level for him. Spark Bark is back, baby. He evolves at level 150. Wow, we're just finding all the new Pokemon now. All right, well, electric's good here. Spark Bark is just hitting all the stuff that's good. And even even Icicle Spear would be good here. Spark Bark is the super effective only character. Wow, okay. Well, good thing we can kill him on account of uh, nine damage from a rapid spin. We're going to go ahead and go back to, uh, his defense is trash. Yeah, his, uh, Spark Bark's defense is absolute trash. When does E3 start? He is fast, yes. He's very fast, and he has decent special attack. That's his, his stats. All right, level five Spark Bark, level four Hondor. Let's do it. You got this, buddy. Half health. Oh, a nice crit. No mirror coat. Ha. Oh. What was that move? This Thursday? Gotcha, gotcha. Hit one, hits once per member of your team. Ah, okay. That's a horrible move for a uh, wild Pokemon to use. Deuces, Spark Bark is on the up and up, baby. Spark Bark up to level six. Uses their attack stat to calculate damage on each hit, if you remember. Nintendo Switch Pro soon. That's what people are saying. No con confirmations there, yeah? Mareep. Uh, we're just going to switch to to Bulba. Mareep, my beloved. A Mareep. This thing is like... It's like, alright. I see why I did three damage. Poison Fang, baby! Let's get a flinch. Let's get a one-hit KO instead. I'll take that. 16 experience for both of us. Stab with the little toes. Another Hound Door. Which we've learned not to fear. Using the core rolls for this run. What do you mean by that? What is with the multi-hit attacks? Yeah, it like a lot of multi-hit attacks early in the game. I guess it I guess it kinda makes sense because we did randomized moves to to select um moves, but then we also preferred uh lower power moves early. So I guess it makes sense that the multi-hits would be early because they have really low power. What's up, Nicodia? Where? Where's the funny YouTube guy? Because <laughs> uh, you're talking about me, probably, I think. Um, so we're going to Thundershock this Hound Door to death. We might hit level 7 here. Baby. Odds on hitting level 7? I had another tab open. Ah, shit. You had another tab open, but you sent the message here. Ah, oh, what an embarrassing mistake. It's like when you wave at somebody and they aren't looking at you. You simply don't quit. All right, here's the Walrein that we're talking about. Level four Walrein versus level 
Six Spark Bark. How is it going to go? Can Walrein defeat Spark Bark or will Sp oh, Spark Bark's got this? Just don't die to Octa. Don't get your accuracy lowered and your Gucci. Spark Bark with a murderer murder. Gets the crit on the second move, says just in case. Thank you, Shan. 109 experience for Spark Bark. Spark Bark goes up. 15 special attack now. Halfway to level 8. And we're on to the Pokemon Center, folks. You strongly dislike Wulu? Yeah, Wulu is like... It's alright. Whatever. Let's see what people have to say here. Got a wonderful smile. Thanks, bud. Uh, yeah, sure. This is a lot of stuff, huh? looking for Is this the game with the island you can make everyone talk about your mom? No, that's the... Uh, is it, actually? I think it might be. Rock, 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 rockhead. <laughs> Fantastic! You're welcome. What do you got to say? I love... This is, like, my favorite... Um, character model over here. I love this one. Nice, dude. When his, when his Pokemon ate an Orenberry, it regained HP. Oh no! Wally! I don't know, dude. Sick, dude. Look at that ray tracing, dude. Norman. It's me, dude. I'm his family. Ooh, way too strong. He lives for Pokemon, dude. Dude's got a slacking. Very powerful. And what do you have to say? Oh. Wow. Hey, check what gym is in the town. I wish I could go through on an adventure crawling through damp grass, dude. Oh. Alright, here we go. Time to fight our dad. Just kidding. It's great news. I'll be looking forward to it. Hello, Mr. Uh, I'd like to get a Pokemon, please. Bill, will you, uh, go with Wally? Good luck, bud. Will it be Ralts? I don't think so. I think it's randomized. We're gonna find out. What Pokemon is Wally gonna catch? Whoa! Whoa! A Trico! Go, not to. Not to use tackle. Trico, use scratch. Not to use tackle. Trico, use scratch. 
You don't get to run it. You, you throw a ball, right? I, I'll do my best. I wish we could name it T-Post 420. I wish we could name his Pokemon T-Post 420. Very nice, very nice. Hey, great work, buddy. Bye. Now, Phil Jr., if you want to become a strong trainer, here's my advice. Head for Rustboro City beyond this town. There you should challenge the gym leader, Roxanne. Find other... Uh, I'm a gym leader, too. We'll battle one day. But that's only after you become strong. All right. That's our team, folks. Spark Bark, Bull Buffet, and Murderer. It is another Nuzlocke. This is the start of a brand new Nuzlocke. We've reached the first town. We have not fought any gyms yet, but we're about to move out and start fighting some more folks. Hopefully not having anybody die. Who knows? I don't really know this game particularly well, so uh, I'm taking risks and stuff that maybe I shouldn't be taking. What's important, folks, is I'm going to run an ad. I will be back in about a minute. See you briefly. Enjoy the music and enjoy looking at these three fabulous Pokemon dancing to the music. That's very funny that Spark Bark and Murderer both beat Boba Fett. Only eight people voted. <laughs> 130 people in here, eight people voted. That's like when, that's like actual American democracy. Polls only open for like a little while. Really hard to vote. All right, cool. Folks. Oh, it's this guy. Rookie trainer, or maybe you're just an ordinary kid. I'm roaming the land in search of talented trainers. I'm sorry to have taken your time. All right, asshole. Damn, just listen to my response. You don't have to just like leave. 
Thanks for playing with Wally. He's been frail. Oh, I, I forgot about this. <laughs> just I, a kid walks into his house and he just starts roasting his son. <laughs> this kid fucking sucks since he was a kid, dude. He needs clean air. But sir, rock, 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 rockhead. Are you ready, folks? That's, oh my God, that song. Oh my God, I can't wait to hear that song, but we're not gonna indulge ourselves until we, oops, that's wrong. Until we have more Pokeballs. I imagine all the caps is shouting in game. All right, how many Pokeballs do we have? We have eight right now. Wow, we're kind of low on Pokeballs already because of what we've caught. Two potions, we have zero right now. All right. Down to $250. Anybody in here give me anything? This song bangs too, dude. Do you use Repel? Alright. You ready? Only Pokemon we can catch on Route 104. Wait, should we have Bulbafet in front for sleep? Will be a beautifly. All right. I mean, it could be good. Sleep it up. You never know. I will uh, go ahead and quick attack it. If it can't live a quick attack, I don't think we're missing out on much. Okay. So we can get it down to one with another quick attack. I am the sickest trainer that ever lived. Enjoy a Pokeball. Enjoy a caught Beautifly. I guarantee it, 100% that this ball will catch this Beautifly. 100%. See? You never, ever doubt the man. He knows what his stuff is. Beautifly's data was added to the Pokedex, folks. It's most... Its colorfully patterned wings are its most prominent features. It flies through flower-covered fields, collecting pollen. It attacks ferociously when angered. Give a nickname. Ugly fly, Susan, bug, beautiful red, beautiful. A 62-pound butterfly is a thing of nightmares. Never doubt Phil. He's done upwards of one Nuzlocke run to completion. I can't believe they didn't notice Beautifly's weird colors. Uh, first try, Pretty Fly. G6. Spink, Fly, Flyconic, Madam Stank, Flyconic gets a double down, G6 gets a double down, Flyconic and G6 seem to be taking the lead here, G6 is the leader right now. Flyconic is maybe kept no nah, it's close. Flyconic is maybe taking the lead right now. It's pretty close. Flyconic takes the win, folks. Beautifly named Flyconic. Take a look at Flyconic's moves here. Ups bug moves in a pinch. That's a good move, a good ability. Leech life, 20 power, folks. <sighs> we might not even touch that Pokemon. Bum bum. Yeah, song back in 2011, they went. Bop, 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 bop. Over and over and over again. Your prediction. Uh, Flyconic will be on the Elite Four team. All right.
I'm not a trainer, but that's right. If trainers lock eyes, it's a challenge to battle. My entire purpose here was to make you think I was a trainer, but then not be one. Hello, youngster. Good luck to us. Ariados, level 5. Okay. The scaling feels lower than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, well, I hope uh, we can beat this and the next one. Because otherwise, we're in trouble. Alright, Riven. Thanks for coming by, bud. Yeah, Ariados has really good design. I always thought Ariados looked very cool. I'll be able to switch after it dies. I didn't realize that. I thought it was a permanent lock. That's a level 12 Bulba Fett, folks. Swab Lou. All right, now we'll test your theory. Um, we're switching to Murderer. Spark Bark took a lot of damage from a, a level 3 Swab Lou's rapid spin. Peck. All right, so the, the leveling isn't as great. I thought I thought he was going to have, like, a couple level 5 Pokemon. At least we're at level 7. I thought we just, like, went way too hard on the training. A lot of bugs get slept on. Yeah, bugs, bugs can be decent. Um, and they certainly got a lot better in later generations. But, uh... Beautiful fly is not uh, what we're looking at. Uh, this is the first one, Leviathan. We did lose uh, a camera up, but we got off the ground. I think it's easier to get off the ground in this one because you, because the trainer that you fight is is like way up there. Uh, Bulba Fett in the front. Actually, you know what? We're going to put Spark Bark in the front. He's level 7 right now. Oh. What the heck? This kid needs to see a therapist. It surely looks tough. His Pokemon has a magical looking quality to it, and it surely looks tough. Pretty good find. I'm sure it used to be a... Uh, uh, Magikarp. All right. Well, we're two levels under, but I think we're okay. I think we could do it, folks. Let's go for gold. Spark bark. Don't die. You got poison, dude. I don't know if I have any antidotes. How are you going to get poisoned by an Omanite? My man. All right. 18 HP. One, two, three. Just make sure it's one HP per tick. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 8 HP. 1, 2, 3. I'm going to have to use a potion. 4. Oh, I have a, I have a Pekka Berry. Okay. Didn't need to... I didn't realize I had one of those. Spark Bark, I never doubted you'd live. <laughs> Spark Bark is the hero of the stream at the moment. Unfortunately, Spark Bark's defense is not good, and I I don't have high hopes for Spark Bark in the long term, but we'll see. Spark Bark is safe. Oh, this is the boat. 
He was once a mighty sailor. Ah, oh, poor guy. No longer a mighty sailor. Oh well. Hell yeah. Spark Bark is a sickly child, but we love him. Orin berries, baby. All right, let's move on to the next section. Uh, it's another trainer, or it's a trainer. We must have been fated to meet. I don't know if we must have been, just because we... Anyway. Hello, Lady Cindy with Execute. I think we could take this fight on account of us having Icicle Spear. Spark Bark with the Icicle Spear, baby. Huge type coverage. Massive move. Terrifying spray, yes. Agreed. Uh, does the berry growing work without the clock working? No. Unfortunately not. Not quite a level for Spark Park, but close. Oh my. All right. Bull Buffet back in front, folks. For anybody who's wondering about lasagna right now, we are not just dropping lasagna. We'll be playing lasagna on Tuesdays still. Is this a trainer? Yeah, Fly I forgot Fly Flyconic existed. Let's give him an Orin Berry as we start this battle, because he's down a few HP, but... I Oh, I caught a whole bunch of Pokemon. This could be feasibly an issue, because they're all random. <laughs> okay, they're level three, good. I was a little, I was a little worried. Boy, the, I was expecting a lot higher leveling. Silver Wind already, though. Pretty good move on that Curlia. She's an Icicle Spirit, will be right. First, Phil streaming and casually says he'll play Lasagna on Tuesday. Yeah, we're playing Oblivion right now. Our character's name is Lasagna. Good point. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense. Hey, Payday! Spark Mark does Payday, dude! That is good, dude. Phil, no, this is Pokemon. Dig. Alright. Well, we're gonna, whatever we do, it's gonna, well, is Beautifly flying? Or is it Bug something? Bug flying, okay. And Bug leech life. We could put Beautifly in, not take the hit, and see if Beautifly can survive against, uh, uh, Pillow Swine. Almost definitely can given that the move is Leech Life. Uh, I'm just going to leave it. We're going to take the hit. We'll be fine. From a level 3 Pila Swine. I think we can handle that. Sorry, yes. Flyconic, my bad. I do mean that. Yes, exclamation mark highlights will get you the highlights from both the previous Pokemon run and the highlights from Oblivion. All of which, if I do say so myself, are good videos. Okay. Good level. Vaporeon. Um, we can't really hit him with uh, water because he's got water absorbed, so we got to go powder snow. Let's see how much it does here. That's funny, Luca. They are excellent videos for anyone who thinks Phil is biased. Thank you. I suppose someone could argue that people watching my stream would also be biased, though. Hey, big crit.
Got a... Yeah, Vaporeon is a really nice design. I have all these Pokemon, but I couldn't win. All right. The only Pokemon we can catch... In this for in Viridian Forest. Only Pokemon we can catch here is a Doduo. I'll take a Doduo. I'll take one. We named the other Doduo Dudu. This should get him to 1 HP without a crit. All right, folks, moving on to the next one. That stinks. <laughs> I would have liked to uh, have one of those, but what are you going to do? Sometimes you make a mistake around these parts. I wonder where, if this is something. Found a dive ball. Wow! Stinky! We would have had a shot at catching an Umbreon, dude. Coins scattered everywhere. Umbreon is bulky as hell. Very good Pokemon to have, but... What the heck, dude? At least he knocked it off so he didn't get it. At least have Bulba kill an Umbreon. That would be painful. Wait, why? Almost out of Orin berries, dude. Gifted. Hey, gift sub from Duffy. Thank you very much. Enjoy that barbecue rib five. You're a thief if you try to steal someone else's Pokemon. You should throw Pokeballs only at wild Pokemon. Okay. Found a Safari Ball. What? Oh, if that was a... Yeah, that would have sucked. How did I just find a safari ball, dude? I'm sure that's worth <laughs> worse than what I, have, what I would have found. Ah, oh, you found one safari ball. A quick claw, dude. I'm sure, that's better than what I would have found. Right, let's get that quick claw on somebody. Give it to our uh, murderer there. Uh, yes, random items. So we've changed a few things since last run. First, uh, above level 35 Pokemon are just evolved. I can't believe I encountered a Doduo. Uh, so that's one thing. Um, second thing is. There's a slight trainer level scaling. So the late game uh, trainers are gonna be higher level. There's like a five to 8% something in that range level scaling. Um, so they'll have a couple extra levels. And then uh, the last thing that is like 
uh, somewhat, uh, I mentioned that Pokemon above level 35 will be evolved, right? The last thing was uh, all the starters were Pokemon that could evolve twice. Uh, which. I'll tell you what, it takes some real strength to subscribe for a full year out in the desert sun. Hey, welcome back, Double Dutch Oven. Thank you for coming back for a full year. A full friggin' year to. Oh, it's this guy. Have you seen any Pokemon called Shroomish around here? I really love that Pokemon. Da 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 da. Uh, does that mean the rival will evolve Pokemon? Um, yes, after a certain level. It was a little quiet. My desktop audio is low at the moment. All right, folks. It's Team Aqua Grunt sending out a Teddy Ursa to battle us. All right, Boba Fett. Fury Cutter, huh? It's a bit of a surprise. I love how our Bulbasaur is basically just like a straight up poison type right now. We should be okay against Fury Cutter still, because we'll just use this and then quick attack to kill. Oh, double slap. All right. Wow. Three. 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 These people with their multi-hits, dude. What is up with its left arm? It's a great question. Bulba Fett is basically a swallet right now. You're kidding me. You're tough. Sorry, bud. You got some nerve meddling with Team Aqua. Come on and battle me again. I wish I could say that, but I'm out of Pokemon. And hey, we of Team Aqua are also after something in Rustboro. Ah, we of Team Aqua are after something in Rustboro. I'll let you go today. Don't meddle with us again, though. Whew, that was awfully close. Thanks to you, he didn't rob me of these important papers. I know. I'll give you a great ball as my thanks. Thanks, dude. Didn't that Team Aqua say there was something after something in Rustboro too? Oh no, it must be there. It must be a crisis. All right, Spark Bark, good job. I could run all the way back, but we're playing a little bit looser this time, even though it's a harder run. I guess by your clothes that you were a shit loser trainer, not worth my time. Doing okay? Stay out of tall grass if you don't want battles. Great tip, bud. Dun -dun 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 -dun. You wear cargo shorts? Bugs. <laughs> Puccina, folks. The classic. It's a dog-eat-dog -dog world out there right now, folks. Hopefully my dog eats his dog, and not vice versa. Oh, almost a one-hit KO. Flatter. Puccina said that's a great move, dude. Keep using it. Oh. Mm. Not gonna risk a crit plus this hurting myself. Can't do it. Can't do it. He has a Gardevoir. Ah, do I switch now? I think I do. I, I switch to Gardevoir now. I can't risk a strong psychic attack. And I'm going to be switching afterwards, so I may as well switch against the Puccina. This Puccina's like, yeah, I'm defeat. Oh, my God. Okay, so I'm s switching back to Bulbasaur. And then switching back to Murderer. This Poochie is like, yeah, you can't handle this heat, dude. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna take him down and then I'll switch afterwards.
it would be better to it would be better to wait, but I'm not I'm not going through that again. <laughs> I'm not encountering another flatter hit. All right, level six. Uh, we'll be safe. Play safe, Phil. Flyconics, time to shine. <laughs> Bug is good against Psychic, guys. Two levels lower. It's it's Flyconic's time to shine, dude. It's game time. Flyconic, you have a shot here. Good luck, bud. Mega Drain, horrible against you. Horrible against you. You got this. One damage. Not gonna happen, dude. Not gonna happen. Game time for Flyconic. Confusion, not gonna be a problem for you, Flyconic. You're good, dude. Wow, you suck. Okay, no worries. Leech Life, it's boosted. It's a boosted ability. <laughs> it'd be su it'd be actual suicide leaving him in there. I'm not gonna go out of my way to let Flyconic die. All right, all right, murderer. Very disappointing Pokemon. Very bad. Unusable, even. Leveled up, though. Got that two special attack. Psychopath playing with the lives of innocent animals. Uh. Stinky. Eradicate. Spark Bark V Eradicate. Should be okay. Mud slap. My odds are still pretty good. Endure. Okay. Not again, buddy. Sorry, doesn't work twice in a row. Deuces. Eradicate horrible teeth. <laughs> 50 bucks, baby. Five, is it $5 per level? Zinc. Some special defense EVs here. So I go ahead and give that to nobody right now. More like Radicant. Another Dragonair here. <laughs> give it to Flyconic. Uh, we'll be okay with an Icicle Spear. Twister is with the move that he had, so. And if he has something like Dragon Rage, then we're boned anyway. Dragon Breath, okay. Alright, we gotta switch. So many bug Pokemon in this forest. So many interesting bugs in this forest. I thought that said Dragon Rage, but it just said Rage. Actually, we would have survived Dragon Rage. Wow. Murderer got that HP, dude. Dragon Rage uh, would be a wipe if not for Murderer. Also, if he killed my first guy, we would have gone first because we were faster. So, Aurora Beam, baby. Yes, I will, and I will get rid of Icicle Spear, folks. Murderer is killing it, dude. Big get. Big get on uh, Murderer. Uh, very, very smart decision to pursue Murderer. Let's get Bulba Fat up in front. We are kind of hurting right now. It will learn Refresh. What does that have to do with firing seeds? Well, nothing. Okay. Are you supposed to think he's giving you bullet seed, or...? What? No, because he wasn't actually... That's weird. He gives you bullet seed in the typical game, right? How many possible Pokemon are there? Um, 300-something. Oozle. 
So why does he say it has nothing to do with what he said? Weirdo. Sure. So I remember loamy soil, dude. I remember soft loamy soil. Oh, hell yeah. A Whalmer Pail! Randomizer might have changed the text. Uh, I'd be surprised. Normal text with a TM name swap, yeah. A berry! She gives you a berry like every day, right? But... I think uh, that'll only be today. Since... Alright. This is Route 104, folks. So we can catch a Pokemon here. And that Pokemon is going to be... And explode! Sleep powder, baby. Hopefully it's going to be an explode at least. I don't know. Fast asleep. I'm going to go quick attack here, because I think Acid is fine, but I don't want to be too risky with it. I do think Explod would be fun. Good thing you didn't start with Wismer. You're absolutely right. That would suck. All right, that'll, that'll be good, and then we'll sleep him again. Nice. All right, Sleep Powder. When your mouth is your entire body, yeah. Explod is... Absolutely goaded Pokemon. Very cool Pokemon. Um, it's not good, but it is very cool. Here we go. No worries. We're going to catch him with this ball. That's going to be one shake. Two shakes, three shakes, and we cut. What the heck? Okay, uh, let's go ahead and use another Pokeball there. Try the Safari Ball? Yeah, maybe. Alright. Safari Ball time, baby. Is the Safari Ball sick? Did I just use a really good ball? It has sound generating organs all over its body. It communicates with others by adjusting the tone and volume of the cries it emits. Same, dude. Give a nickname to the captured Exploud. A silent voice. A little long, unfortunately. Screamo, boombox, ah. Uh. I think we know if, if we name him ah uh, that I will have difficulty saying his name after Z. Boombox has a few. The love Below is way too long. Big Hippo. Boombox works. We got some serious Enthusiasm in the chat for Boombox with Boombox Works. Hippo, okay. Organ piano. Big hippo. Speaker. Speaker box would fit with one X, yeah. Boombox. Alright, Boombox. Boombox is satisfactory. Take a look at Boombox, dude. We didn't see anything other than Attract, right? Yawn, Attract, Uproar, and Karate Chop. Avoid sound base moves. And stats. I mean, just compare it to like Beautifly. All the stats are higher than Beautifly, right? Um. It's just, uh, it's, it's not amazing, but and the crowd goes wild for the nickname choice. 
Found a white flute! I thought it was the one that cured confusion, dude. A silk scarf! I'll give it to uh, Bulba Fett for now. Because he's out in front. Another Quick Claw! Dead! No, it's it just like it's like using um, Sweet Scent or whatever. It attracts a Pokemon immediately. Oh, Kangaskhan! All right. Bulbafet versus Kangaskhan, folks. Poison Fang. And then he tickled me. Two's acid has 100%. Typical parent, to be honest. All right, nothing in that last spot. Walk through this area. Ah, I thought we got out with another fight. A Nidorino. Quick attack. We're part poison, so we don't have to fear the poison stuff as much. Got him. Imagine getting tickled by an animal before you kill it. <laughs> brutal. Absolutely brutal. Speaking of killing stuff, let's get Murderer up front. In the second spot, because I believe there's a two battle here. Hmm. Boy, this is quite the, quite the route, actually. We're, like, encountering a lot of people. Uh, because they don't grow, Staticus. I like, I like Outcast. Ralts, level 7. Bulba Fett, level 13. I think we can handle it with two quick attacks. Future Sight, okay. If he has other Pokemon, which I don't remember, that could be an issue, but I don't think he does. No working clock in what I'm using, correct. And my, uh, my battery died in my, uh, Game Boy. Uh, I need the, the absolutely wild survey that 10% of people think they could kill animals like lions and elephants with their bare hands. They think they could kill an elephant with their bare hands. Ah. People are... gorilla was on there my lord people are so dumb a girl just l let me be very clear with everybody here a gorilla is built to destroy you y you have no shot oh i could have used aurora beam should have and i should have used aurora beam that's so wild A fable. If I had quick claw, I might be able to do some damage. Um, reversal doesn't hit for super effective, right? Is what I'm realizing. Re reversal is just like a damage, a certain amount of damage move, right? It does in this generation. I'm going to try it. Okay, it does. What move is that? I, I don't know. Whatever, but like... Skull Bash. Okay. Grizzly Bear was the lowest. Too many people saw the Revenant and were like, I'm no Leo. But they said yes to elephant, dude. 
No shot, buddy. How much HP? <sighs> it's not ideal, but I have to use another potion. It's literally haunting me. Uh, the twins from The Shining, folks. Donfin and Radicate. Good lord. All right. Said we're not screwing around with you. Um, we're gonna poison fang bite him. We're gonna bubble beam the Donfin. Radicate. Classic. Donfin, my beloved. Murderer leveled up. Go ahead and poison fang him. Just quick attack should do the trick. Powder snow to follow up. Nice. Huh, I thought Boba Fett was gonna level up there. Boba Fett did not level up. Dun, 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 are these Leppa? Are these Leppa, baby? Hey, we love Leppa berries. Leppa berries are just ethers. Nope. Not gonna do it. Yeah, lions, no shot. No shot, dude. They're so big and strong, dude. <laughs> They are just so big and strong. They are simply so big and so strong. Of course it wouldn't be close. They are so big and so strong. <laughs> just because you like think stuff doesn't mean you can like fight a lion. They're so big and so strong. I'm the water Pokemon expert. All right, let's see if you have one water Pokemon. That's a lot. Uh, it's good. It's only level five. How are they still only level five? I would have thought we would have been like much, like I, I don't even feel afraid with my Bulbasaur right now. Houndoom, my beloved. Maybe I broke the scaling? I don't, I don't think so. Maybe you can, I'm different. Classic. Yeah, you can, I'm built different. 60% uh, grass attack, folks. Keeping Poison Fang, we're getting rid of acid, folks. All right, Bangers, thanks for coming by. region. The champion is a water type expert. This guy. No, I'm the water type expert. Wait, wants to also learn leaf blade? What the heck? You know what needle arm reminds me of? Uh, I guess we take leaf blade instead of... Do we take it instead of needle arm? I mean, needle arm could... Uh... Could I see myself as a pro boxer? I don't think so. I already did my combat sport for my life. Uh, Cacnea, my beloved. Uh, should I get rid of quick attack or needle arm here? Needle arm can cause flinching, so that's like useful. Uh, leaf blade is more powerful. And, well, I'm definitely taking leaf blade. Um, it's just, do I take it over quick attack or do I get rid of needle arm? Um, How fast is Boba Fett to get the use out of Nebel Iron? It's not so much like, will he win in an equal level matchup? It's more, will he win, period, on speed. Um, Leaf Blade has a special place in my heart because my Gravile learned it in the second fight against May. Nice. Get rid of Needle Arm? All right. 
Needle arm didn't even get used once, dude. Yeah, I mean, he's been going first. And Umbreon. Alright. Goodbye, Umbreon. It's Leaf Blade. Sick animation time. Love that animation, dude. Oh. Good thing that wasn't uh, a counter type move. Rude of you to knock off my silk scarf. Barboach! Is that also your beloved? This absolutely reviled Pokemon. There it is. Water expert. Got the Barboach. Hey, folks! Are you ready? Huge moment for us. Bulba Fett is now Ivy Fett. I Ivy uh, Ivy Sauron. It, it evolved, is what I'm saying. He sit. Boba Fett sit. A lot better stats very quickly. Boba Fett is now a contender. Wait, did Boombox wake up? Oh, I went to I went to yeah, I healed everybody. Of course Boombox woke up. Let's get this item. Me getting this item when I was a kid, like, oh, I got him so smart. I'm so smart that I realized that you could go in this thing. So smart. Didn't think about evolutions when I proposed Bulba Fett as the name. Well, that's just the name. You know? It's just the name. Don't matter. The Emerald Spite is cute. I'm sure Venusaur will be terrifying as always, though, so no worries. Okay. So I guess I, I probably should have been training Boombox a little bit on the and Spark Park on the people who were a little bit lower level. Man Next Door gave you an HM, huh? What's up with the trainers being really easy? I mean, it is before you've even fought the first gym. So maybe I'm just like overthinking it because I the last thing I was fighting was the Elite Four in a game that kills everybody. Obviously a skilled trainer. Don't say a word. I'm sure you can put this hidden machine to good use. No need to be modest or shy. Heck yes. Alright Duffy, thanks for coming by. See you around. Great. Cool. Alright, bye. Okay. One sec, I'm gonna retweet the old uh Stream announcement tweet. Right. Uh, off to the gym, I guess? Or is there something that happens before we go to the gym? That's the museum. All right. Got 1,390 style points right now. All right, I, I'm not gonna give you credit because it's not true, dude. It's random. You're lying to me. All right, so. Let's put Boombox out in front. Let's start with Boombox. Why bother with a liar? Seriously, dude's just lying to me. Lying through his teeth, dude. A cl level 11 Clefable. Okay, so it ramps up pretty quick here. There's our terrifying Pokemon. Flyconic is so lonely. <laughs> All right. 
Oh, that could be bad. Maximized attack. Uh. Oh boy. Uh, let's hope we kill it here. Oh, please kill it. Oh. Okay. It used a move that is is slow. Okay. Uh, Roar beams 100%. Whew. Okay. Okay. If he hit that, <laughs> if he hit that, murderer was dead. Or even if he used a better move up top, maybe. Hey, Boombox leveled up twice, did. Not too shabby. Who else we got? We got another youngster. All right. Uh, let's put Sparkbark up front. Boombox got a couple levels. Oh, would this be a double battle? Or two in a row? Is this going to be a double battle if I take a step up? Nice. I love getting two uh, contrary messages. All right, here we go, folks. Murderer is evolving into murdery. Gloom and Dugong. Okay, so we can we can Thundershock the Dugong, and we can Ice Beam or Aurora Beam the Gloom. Perfect, dude. Like we planned it. In uh, I think in Gen three, uh, for like Fire Red, it it does one and then the other one, but. Where'd I get my Game Boy from? Um, it was a gift. All right, who's coming out next? A Kecleon, a classic, absolute classic over here. I think you did, Sodicus, but you can always do it again. Introduce double battles, yes. That uh, twins battle is the first double battle ever in Pokemon. Uh, Thundershock this guy, and then Bubble Beam that guy. Because if we Bubble Beam that guy, I can then Thundershock afterwards, after he turns into a water Pokemon here. That's what we call genius level play, dude. I know it's a children's game, but, uh... I'm kind of a genius. <laughs> Ridiculous. Joey. All right, Kakleon use Leer. Um, maybe I want to Thundershock the Gorbis instead, and then what is, uh, he's got fighting now. We're, we're going to Thundershock the Kakleon to kill him, and we're going to, I guess we'll just Aurora Beam this guy. Oh, wow. It's better than I thought it would be. Yeah, Spark Bark, dude. Spark Bark doing the work, dude. Straight up work. Water Pulse, okay. As if, Gorbis. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do a little bit of disrespect. I'm gonna payday you to death. Seven months, Seven months. that's what you done. That's what you done. Hey, welcome back, Evan. Oh, I crit. That sucks. Seven months is such a good one. Seven months is a banger. Wow, you've got some potential. Oh, man, oh, man. Our challenger is one feisty customer. All right. Evan, thank you very much for coming back for seven months, buddy. Appreciate it. Appreciate the sub. Teal up. It's Roxanne time, folks. We might be rushing Roxanne a little bit, but uh, sometimes you just gotta go in head first, guys. But am I buying what they're selling? <laughs> yes, I am. Why do you hope that, Violet Dark Kitty? You want it? You want us to die? Damn! 
chat rooting against me at every turn. <sighs> Here we go, folks. Roxanne, the Rustboro Pokemon Gym Leader, wants me to demonstrate how I battle and with which Pokemon. A Curlia level 13. All right. It's a little bit uh, good. Isn't that every battle seeing which Pokemon and how they are used? Murderer with a crit on the first Pokemon, a big level up, some good stats added on. Level 16. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Uh, we have nothing that's super effective against him. Bubble Beam it is. Alright, Sandstorm. Level 13 Metagross, dude. That thing's wild. Do I speak another language? No. Oh, don't. 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 Okay. No! <laughs> your potion's not that good because your Pokemon is sick. Oh yeah, this thing's sick. This Pokemon is so cool. Crazy that he has Sandstorm too. Okay, Roxanne, what are you, me playing Oblivion? What is going on right now? Roxanne went to the Potion Master for the strongest potions. All right, no more potions. And I think that was also the last turn of Sandstorm, if I was counting right. Or this, this like, maybe this is? I, I don't remember. Murderer just absolutely getting... What a trainer! What a trainer. No! I had exactly 40 HP, dude! Murderer. Oh, we're in trouble now. Oh, what are you eating? Oh, what are you eating, dude? Oh, dear. Um, 48 HP, so we could Leaf Blade and then we can Quick Attack. Oh, don't, don't paralyze me. Oh, no, dude. Oh, no, dude. Oh, no, dude. It's not a misplay, Flare Bro. Okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. Go on, go on, Flare Bro. Why is it misplay? Tell me why it's a misplay. I have to own you real quick, because you're coming in my chat talking shit. First of all, Dragonair is not part flying. Grass is half effective against Dragon. It is not part flying. You're wrong about that. Second, second, it has 70 base power. Same type attack bonus, half effective. If your if your premise was only that it's half effective, it's 52.5 base power plus a chance to crit versus a 40 base power with lower attack. Get out of here, Flare Bro! Don't talk shit in my chat unless you know what you're fucking talking about. <laughs> okay, so so uh, here's the question: Do we use a potion here? Um, I think we go for the I think we go for the crit. Ah, uh, quick attack isn't gonna kill it. If Leaf Blade didn't kill it, um, 
Yeah, she's faster. She's going to use Dragon Breath next turn. I think this might be the end of the run, dude. I'm sorry, player pro. I gotta do the bit when it when it when it pops up. Um, quick attack should kill from this ring. I don't think so. Yes, Leaf Blade had half effectiveness, but it's a 70 base power move. I just went through this. What are you talking about, guys? Don't make me do it again. Don't make me do the bit again. Uh, I have to hope he uses uh, Dragon Breath. That's really what it comes down to. It's a dead run if if. It's like a dead run. We have to hope for quick attack. Like, we have to. We have to hope he uses the wrong attack. Well, we started it a little quick, I guess, guys. Um, <laughs> uh, we might have started the the gym a little bit quick. Yeah, Spark Bark has ice, but Spark Bark is too slow. Um, so we're just hoping for bad AI at this point. Nobody's got more than uh, 40 HP, so it really just comes down to will they use a non-Dragon Rage attack? Uh, good luck to us. You know, there was a setting. Uh, there was a setting to turn off uh, game-breaking moves, and one of the game-breaking moves is Dragon Rage, and I said, it won't be a big problem. Quick Claw! Quick Claw! Oh my god! The run is alive and I've only got Boombox? Oh my god. Oh my god! And Flyconic? Oh my lord. We lost three, dude! Oh no. Oh no, dude. I'm so sad. Alexa play Despacito, dude. Holy shit. We lost our starter. We lost our other dude. Oh my gosh, we killed the Metagross easily, and then we encountered a Dragonair that had Dragon Breath and Dragon Rage. Alright, let's take our trip to hell, folks. We're not restarting. We, we aren't restarting, we're trying. Don't take my goods! Don't take my goods, dude. You can have my bads, but not my goods. <laughs> uh, that hurt. That really hurt me a lot. I'm in pain. All right, uh, let's go to move Pokemon. And what we got to do here is we got to go to party Pokemon. And we're going to have to put uh, our wall rain in there. And also spark bark, which might hurt the most. And then also Bulba Fett. So let's go ahead and take uh, that and put it in the bag. Take that and put it in the bag there. Oh, that hurt. Hurt me. Hurt me a lot. It would have been so funny if he used Dragon Rage against uh, Boombox after the thing and then Flyconic came in and leech lifed him. Yeah, Spark Bark died so quickly. We only lived because Roxanne was like, wow, you're 
I'm killing too many of his Pokemon. I'm gonna use Dragon Breath instead. Because Uproar didn't one-shot. Uproar got him to like one HP. Oh boy. Well, we kind of ended up with what we said at the beginning with, we should start with Wismer, because uh, now we have a Beautifly and, <laughs> and an Exploud. Uh, and the Exploud only has one normal move and it locks him into normal moves for two to five turns. Uh, we're gonna have to go level up uh, our Flyconic a couple times. <laughs> In this path. Uh, oh, we could teach him Cut, though. What's Cut in this generation? Is it terrible? Good? 5095? Okay. I think we give him that instead of, uh, instead of Uproar, because Uproar locks him in. And, and we would... Uh, we have to give one of our main Pokemon a HM that is going to lock him in, but I think we just have to. The leader's not too far, yeah. Alright. Oh, boy. Flyconic's getting the chance she deserves. Well... Um, anyone can learn Cut. Uh, because I have that set on. Just in case I was get Like, I didn't want to hit a hard wall, so I turned on full HM compatibility. The rule was that, like... I can't, like, have a Magikarp learn Surf and do whatever. All right. Flyconic is now uh, going to have a chance at uh, being used. That sucked. That sucked a lot. Was not a fan of seeing that Dragon Rage show up in my... Uh, my Game Boy there. I could have trained before. I could have learned my lesson and trained before is what I could have done. I should have learned my lesson from my first run in that uh, don't listen to people when they're like, oh, you're doing an awful lot of training because uh, you're e even like that was even levels, and he stopped us. <laughs> Alright, see you, Spice Slicer. Bailey, you as well. No, wait, 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 wait. Never mind. Me too. Not me too leaving. Me oh, come on. You gotta be joking me, dude. At least we have Moonlight, so... Iconic grew to level six. No moves yet. For, uh... No, 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 I'm not geeky. I thought you said you were leaving. My bad. <laughs> Liquefies the user's body to sharply raise. I guess I could teach him refresh for the express purpose of uh, healing his poison that he has right now. Bum, bum. I hope this doesn't become an issue. I'm gonna use a leech life here, because he's fighting, so... If he uses a fighting move, it's gonna be very ineffective. Wow, horrible. Okay. Oh god, triple kick against Exploud. Am I is this run dead? Even though he's level four. Run. Uh we can we can try to catch another Pokemon, but we have to we have to be a little higher level for me to feel at all comfortable with giving that a shot right now. We're down to we're down to a horrible bug Pokemon and Exploud. Um <clears throat> Ice ball, you say? All right. I'm glad Boombox has Karate Chop. If we hit a trainer right now, it's game over. Pretty much. Pretty much. 
praying to God the next root encounter is Dunsparce. <laughs> uh, I hate Dunsparce. I hope not. Dun, 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 dun. I have a soft spot for Boombox because I named him, uh, but the monkey's paw sure did curl on that one. Yeah. We're in rough shape right now. We have more dead Pokemon than we have living Pokemon currently. Hey, the Karate Chop crit. You love to see it, folks. All right, Flyconic has leveled up to level seven. Continues to refuse to learn a move other than Leech Life. Flyconic is absolutely refusing to be useful currently. <laughs> Says, not gonna, not gonna happen, buddy. Don't, don't try it. Uh, where do you get the, uh, where do you get the uh, old rod? Is it in Rasporo? Everything's gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine, dude. Next trainer will have Shedinja. I think I, I think I did the setting of no early Shedinja. It's the Cutter's house. Dude's name is. Oh, you get an item in here, don't you? Oh no. Pokemon are strange creatures. All right, thanks. See ya. A funny word or phrase. Bingy. 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 Hmm. She's not smiling at all. All right. She sucks. All right. Let's leave. for town for old ord. <laughs> this MF said old ord. Here it is. Here's the trainer. Imagine not smiling when someone says bengi. This is such school music. Great school music. Oh, you wanted a C dot. My name's Scott. Okay. Well, maybe you should see me as a trainer, dude. Scott's like, you're not a trainer. Peace. Oh, I should have seen you in battle. Eh, bye. <laughs> Catching a Pokemon, their dad's like, I bet, I bet that one's going to be a great friend. <laughs> Kid looking at the Pokemon. Yeah, maybe this one. Uh, just very carefully exploring here. There's an item and there's no trainers, so let's go see what that is. I'm so scared. I remember that that you could surf over there. Used to be able to find uh, berry juice. Uh, used to be able to find uh, not to over there, right? What's berry juice? 100% pure juice that restores HP by 20 points. What a treat. Uh, okay, let's level up our friggin' horrible bug Pokemon a little more. Flyconic did. You weaseled your way onto the team. Simply by virtue of me not expecting Dragonair having a Dragon Rage. Oh, what horrible, horrible, horrible luck.
Yeah, I need to buy some more Pokeballs before we go off to do that. You're right. Best of juice if you give Shuckle a berry, it holds to turn into berry juice. I gotcha. Karate chop, baby. Yeah. Deuces. All right, come on. Let's get a, let's get a new move. You've had enough fun, Flyconic. You've you've freeloaded for too long. We need you to have an actual move here. We need you to get like gust, or like at least have a juicy highlight video. All right, level three we can handle. We can. I mean, not with Flyconic. Flyconic can't kill anybody. Like <laughs> Flyconic is completely useless. But Boombox can handle a level three hit, hit my top, even with triple kick. Rapid spin, all right. Cut. I'm gonna need a content warning on the highlight reel. <laughs> what a rough time. What a rough time, dude. Out here training a freaking Beautifly using my strong Pokemon. My Exploud. <laughs> uh, if we had one more HP, Walrein would have killed Dragonair. Wouldn't have been an issue. Literally one more HP. Amelius, what's up? Has there been a casualty, Bradley? Oh, uh, let me let me check. Uh, we just we just beat the uh, gym, and uh, this is what our team looks like. <laughs> so, uh, there have been a couple casualties. Um. We ran into a uh, Dragonair who had uh, the move Dragon Rage. Uh, and as a result, everybody died. This is uh, an underdog story where Flyconic becomes determined to become the most powerful Pokemon after seeing her friends being brutally murdered in front of her. It's possible. I don't think it's gonna be that, that type of uh, thing. Supposing, uh, uh, she still hasn't learned to move. <laughs> I can't also, apparently it's a rare one on this route, so I can't believe it's the one we found. Let's cut up this bug. Strike her down and she will become more powerful than you can ever imagine. Yes, Boba Fett was the shy little frog. And now he's dead. Dead. Alright, boombox. Won't learn anything before 10? I don't know. I have no idea. I guess, I guess maybe. You don't have to rub it in. Hey, I'm just trying to come to terms with it myself. We all grieve in different ways. I gotta say it out loud to make sure I know it's real. So I don't, it, I don't let it happen again. Uh, ideal Pokemon to nab between Hitman Top, Nidoran, uh, and Kangaskhan. Uh, prob I probably would have gone for Nidoran. Uh, cause, uh, Nido King is amazing. A uh, very, very good Pokemon. Um, but, uh... <laughs> it's okay, Sadakus. We can grieve together. Uh, but either of the other... Like, Hitmontop and Kangaskhan are both... Strong. I'd, pro I'd probably choose Beautifly, to be honest. She's a Caterpie clone. She's the final Evolve, and there won't be any moves to learn until 10 or post-10. Um, 
Right. That's probably true. Uh, we're back up to level 13. Of course, our uh, when we fought the gym, we had two level 16 Pokemon. Uh, so even after all of this grinding, uh, we are not even close to le level one gym. The first to, to be able to fight the first gym. So uh, we're in big trouble right now, and that is why we are continuously fighting these fellers. Think Flyconic can handle a Kangaskhan? I don't think so. Ice Ball will absolutely chunk it. One step forward, three steps back. Big steps back. I'm very glad Boombox got enough levels to be able to handle these guys easily, at least. Because otherwise, this would be this would be painstaking. This is just the, the setback. This is the call to action in the hero's... Uh, I was going to say the second one wouldn't be as hard as normal, but we know what happened with the first there. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the first one was a lot harder than it typically would have been. Yeah, he learns a bunch of powders at, at 15, right? Would we be training Flyconic if we didn't believe in her? Yes, because we have to. <laughs> we, we literally have to. We don't have an option. We, we need to have a backup to Boombox. Because if we encounter, like, a fighting type that is strong at all. We need like a flying type to fall back on. Um, and Beautifly has that. All right, Karate Chop. I think Flyconic making the team is exactly what was supposed to happen. It's a shame. It's a real shame. It might be what was supposed to happen, but it's a shame how it happened. All right, Nidorino. Unless it wasn't, and then we're screwed. <laughs> Don't poison me. Don't poison me. Very rude. 32 HP. If, I, if, if he doesn't die, I'll moonlight. Okay. That's all right, I've got, I've got, uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I'm not gonna make it. <clears throat> da, 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 da. <clears throat> you know, sometimes you start a little, uh, start a little run, and you encounter some troubles. Um, ah, oh, that really hurts, only seeing two Pokeballs placed on the, on the thing. What you gonna do, folks? We were spoiled. We only ever lost a run in the, in the rival battle. You know? Let's buy ten Pokeballs here. Let's buy... Three potions. Let's buy one super potion. Buy uh, two antidotes. Okay. Couple more levels. We need to get. We need. We really need to get. Uh, desperately need to get a move here. A poison death at the Poké Center? Oh no. That's that's painful. I hope you learn a move at level 10, Beautifly. Flyconic. Please learn a move at level 10. I know your stats are never going to be good, but I hope your moves can at least make up for that. Do me proud, Flyconic. This is your chance to be... Uh, about to level up. Alright, another level for Boombox. Okay. 
three, two, one, two, two, two. It's not horrible. A little bit of HP, a little bit of attack. I'll take it. <clears throat> Will Flyconic ever earn Phil's love? It's possible. We're gonna find out right now if, if Flyconic earns a little bit of love. Holding out your Pokemon to Nurse Joy with tears in your eyes like 15 feet away, she's just looking at you smiling. Flyconic learns Dragon Breath. What if Flyconic learned Dragon Rage? That would be so funny. All right, two, ah, oh, same level. Sucks so bad, dude. Oh my god. <sighs> Leech life and feather dance, dude. And I, do, I don't even have like... I don't even have like a TM to give it something that like... Works. They say it's bad for him to laugh at the misfortune of others, but. <laughs> oh my god, dude. It's so rough. It's so rough. It's just boombox and then just dead weight. Okay. Uh. I'm just gonna see how poorly this goes. Ice ball, okay, let's see. Okay, we can win this fight. I think we can win this fight. We're twice its level. I think we can win this fight against this wild Pokemon. Was I a good Pokemon? No, you were the worst. Forgot about Flyconic being 60 pounds of bug. We can fight like one Kangaskhan. Does that get stronger? Does Ice Ball get stronger? Have I fucked my run? I can't even beat the friggin- Okay. This won't- this, this won't kill Boombox, though. If it's only doing, like, a third of the health of Flyconic super effective, it won't kill him. I can't even believe how bad he is. He's so bad! He's- he- he reaches new levels of impressiveness in how bad he is <laughs> every time I use him. Oh, my lord. You'll get him next time. Doubles in power up to five times. So the next one would have killed him, probably. Okay. Um... I, we, we can't fight a trainer, dude. We're so weak. We, we were cut off at the knees. Calling it. Flyconic will kill the champion's last Pokemon. Uh, I will be amazed if we make it to the Elite Four and we have to use Flyconic. 
We can try two hands, but I think before we do, I think we have to fight a trainer. I think we have to fight that uh, Team Aqua Grunt before we can um, a crit right off the bat, huh? Um, uh, all right. I think Flyconic should be able to beat at least one level five Kangaskhan first. Yeah, maybe at level 11. Okay, level four. Let's try the level four. Let's try to beat the level four Kangaskhan with Flyconic. Okay, I should be able to do that with three Leech Lifes. Three staff boosted, two and a half times his level leech life. Should be able to do the trick here. New Flyconic movie level 13. Ugh, agonizing. Agonizingly bad Pokemon. Okay. We took him down, dude. Flyconic's first victory is over this level four Kangaskhan. Feather Dance will not affect Ice Ball because it is a special attack move. So if you find a level four Kangaskhan, we can kill it with Flyconic. All right. The game is just like presenting everything we need to be able to use this Flyconic. Meanwhile, I think every experience we give it instead of Exploud is a horrible mistake. Is she about to do it again? She can't be stopped, dude. Flyconic is so strong, dude. This bug is just draining these Kangaskhan's energy, dude. It uh, sharply lowers the opponent's attack. Ah, uh, yes. One more attack. Oh boy. It's not happening, Freddy. There's no shot I'm letting that fight happen. It would just, it would never end. I'm so emotionally invested in this Pokemon and its underdog story right now. I am not. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just. We're, we're treading water with it as long as we can. At level 13, we'll see if it learns a move that it that is even possibly useful. Leech Life is so bad, dude. The Miyagi to Flyconics, Daniel. If she dies, she dies. All right, didn't get poisoned. You love to see it. Cut up the Nidorino. Come on, dude. Poison points, dude. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Just make sure I'm not doing something stupid. Twenty-six, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm not out, but I'm not wasting anything. Yeah, if it was Switch, uh, Leech Life would be strong, yeah. Sword Shield. Next trainer we see Horn Drills, Boombox. Ugh, I would, I would lose my mind. Okay, so you said there's, there's grass without fighting a trainer here? All right, I will take your word for it. I don't know why I'm saving. I'm saving like it matters. It doesn't. I can't bring them back. Oh, that's a lie, okay. All right, there's a grunt. Bye.
I'm glad I did not listen. Thank you. Thank you for stopping me. Level 4 Kangaskhan? Hitmon top. Can't fight the Hitmon top. What's up, Rat King? Uh, well, uh, we started this uh, run. Our starter was a Bulbasaur. Uh, Love the bop. Uh, we named him Bulbafet. Uh, we caught a uh, an Electrike on the first route. We caught. Uh, uh, let me just tell you while I'm walking. Oh, I'm going to grab a cookie. We caught an Electrike on the first route. Uh, we headed up. We caught a Camerupt. Unfortunately, we lost the Camerupt. Um, so you won't see him in our team uh, because we lost the Camerupt fighting a Walrein. Um, after we fought uh, the Walrein, we caught the Walrein. So we ended up with a Walrein named Murderer. Uh, we moved on. We tried to catch someone in the forest. We didn't end up catching him. But we did catch this Beautifly as well as uh, a uh, as, as well as an Exploud. Uh, and then we went to the gym. And uh, most of them died. And so now we have a Beautifly and an Exploud. Um, <laughs> we, we hit a Dragon Air with Dragon Rage. So that's what's up. But I got a cookie, so. We are going to win this. Is bug special or physical? Uh, chocolate chip, but they're uh, like big and soft. Homemade. That stinks that it's physical. We probably won't be able to kill it. Yep, we have to switch. Our catch rate's default. Um, so there's no chance that I roll a legendary. I do not bake that much. Uh, my girlfriend made these. Uh, karate chop. I do cook, though. What's up, John? All right, Beautifly is going to absolutely level up, learn uh, Arrow Blast. I guarantee it. Two trainers in that bit of grass and the team team Aqua Grunt. I'm glad I did not uh, go. Oh, we're so under leveled to where we should be. My my cookie. They died, Exogenesis. They died. It was a slaughter. A Dragonair had Dragon Rage and just slaughtered everybody. I also can't believe how long it's taking to level up Flyconic. Does she have like a high amount of experience needed? I think Boombox, who is a higher level, is leveling up faster than Flyconic is. Which is just insult to injury, really. It's really just insult to injury. For Boombox. Good God. Boombox is so much better. Try attack, dude. Are you kidding me? Like, this guy rules. He absolutely rules, dude. Um... I think we probably get rid of Attract. Moonlight has an outside use case, especially as a as like my only Pokemon. So I feel like Attract is probably the one we get rid of. It's a good status effect, but 
it's so situational and uh, much less likely we use it. I, I almost just straight up don't even want to train this Pokemon anymore, but I, I've, I've committed now. I'm going to incorrectly analyze this sunk cost and just say we're, we're going all in. Goat box. Boombox is sick now. Boombox has a silk scarf, is normal, and has tri attacked it. Let's use that crap. So sick. It is not possible, King Meta Comet. Thank God it is not possible. Next Pokemon's name is going to be Sunk Cost. If we even get to the next Pokemon. There is a very real chance that we die on this next trainer, because at some point I'm going to say we've trained enough and we're going to have to go for it. Maybe I train in the in the forest? I know they have Dragonairs there, but they're too low level to have Dragon Rage. Um, they only have Dragon Breath before. Well, I, I don't know that for sure, actually. They could easily have it. Yeah, the thing is, there's Dragonairs there, D-Storm. Um, I want to give Flyconic another move. Who gonna? I'm trying. Flyconic is really resisting the effort right now. <laughs> Flyconic says... Is there, is there another, like, TM in this city? Or, like, another tutor? Rate is medium fast, apparently s slower than medium slow until level 68. Is there something in here, maybe? Robber must not have been very bright. How could we get robbed? Okay, no. Beautifly can't learn fly in the original game. And Beautifly stinks, dude. A 62 pound bug can't fly. Can't fly you on its back. The word fly is in its frickin' name, dude. I think what we're doing is when, when Flyconic learns a move, we're going to fight the trainer. What's the prediction? Will we get a good move at level 13? Beauty Sync, nice. Let's just get a crit so we don't have to worry about another attack here. Uh -oh. I had to try so many sentences. A not not a, a damaging move. A move that isn't just obvious trash. Uh, like low accuracy with low power would be trash. Uh, I'm, I'll be the judge of whether it's not a bad move. It, a good move is, is maybe too too much to expect of Flyconic. Uh, I think acceptable is really what we're looking for. I don't know if we've looked at every house Violet Dark Kitty. That's, that's why I asked. Uh, if anybody, like, knew if there was a TM or something in this. That's all good, Shahan. We'll say, the, the rules are, I'll rule if it's, like, an acceptable move. Like, if it's somewhat useful. Uh, obviously, like, Feather Dance is not gonna be. Uh, it's randomized moves, King Metacomet. So, if you predicted based on Googling what moves it learns... You might be <laughs> might be in for a rude awakening. On account of uh, our beautifully learning Feather Dance at level 10. Oh, it's a good prediction by Shan. I gotcha. No, yeah, I agree. I agree. That's what everybody's everybody's here to find out right now. If if this Pokemon can learn anything, 
the, the first three hours of the stream were jam-packed with highlights, and now the past hour has just been... <laughs> uh, you got 33 more experience for your bug. Tri-Attack does have a sick animation. Most moves are better than Leech Life. That's true. Feather Dance is not. Can I not even kill this one? You tickle? I can't kill him! I can't- I won't kill him in time for the ice ball to <sighs> This level 12 bug cannot kill a level 5 normal Pokemon. You missed the action-packed part of the stream, so now you're very attached to Flyconic. I uh, played the rest of the stream, and as a result, I am... I could not be less attached to Flyconic. <laughs> Fe Feather Dance is like Growl 2.0. Okay. What if, uh, if Iconic just learned Earthquake? At level 13. <laughs> Honestly, even with two moves, worth it to forget Feather Dance anyway. Okay, wait, I think I can kill the Kangaskhan, even if it's using Ice Ball. You have to stand in grass to use the White Flute. It takes about as, the same amount of time to do it either way. Maybe, Phil, maybe be more positive towards her and she will improve. Oh yeah, she definitely hears me, dude. You're right. Blyconic, look, I know we've had our trials and tribulations in the past, and I just want to say, I hope when this lucky number 13 arrives, when you level up and we sit down to t discuss your growth at this company and your your uh, uh, s s your niche, your absolute... Uh, uh, also, well-timed prediction, Jan. Uh, your... Uh, growth path and, and what you want to do with your future. I hope you consider learning a fucking move. I can't even kill him. I got tickled and I have to run away. Okay. Can you imagine if Flyconic were the only Pokemon and we had to run all the way back to the first route to fight, uh... <laughs> to fight, uh, Electrikes because maybe we could kill Electrites and then we lost the Electrike because we would? That would be an incredible end to the run, to be honest. Would you have been able to make it back to the first route? We could jump off ledges and probably make it back, yeah. All right, you guys ready to maybe level up this Flyconic here? If it were the only Pokemon, I might restart. I would probably, I would probably send Flyconic out to fight like Claydol or something. Is what would happen, or like, I would take the fight. I would give Flyconic the honor of a, a game-ending death. Which, to be honest, she still might get that opportunity. She didn't level up there. Okay, one more. All right, folks. The interesting thing about this uh, is both of these Pokemon are now getting a lot of uh, effort values very early. Uh, and I think Beautifly would give like some actually decent effort values, right? Because she's a third level evolution. What effort value does she give? Would I restart if I die right at the end of the stream? Um, yeah, yeah, I'm sure. Uh, but I'm, I'm going to be moving between because I'm going to be playing Oblivion on Tuesday. All right, guys. Good luck to us. Flyconic is about to learn a new move. It's going to be... I 
I mean... That is like the perfect move for me to not know how to answer this prediction. I guess, I guess the answer is it's, it's, it is a good move to have because our base right now is 20, uh, and it has a, a stab bonus. Like, like, like watch, watch how much better it is than leech life. You're actually going to lose your mind how much better it is. Watch, watch this. Watch this fight here. Like, we actually have a usable move now. The Pokemon is still borderline unusable. But we can actually fight stuff. We have some coverage. Three special attack per fight. It's so funny that it's three special attack per fight on a normal type and a bug flying type. Like, that's feasibly, like, a great... A great thing to train on for anybody but these Pokemon. Alright. I'm sorry that you feel robbed. Peck is like, it's like a usable move. It's, it's, it's something that we need here. All right, Boombox is still going up front. We have to hope that Boombox can really carry us. It would be special if this were Gen 4, yeah. It would be, it is not though. Dude, this guy gets robbed all the time. Gotta get the Devon Goods back. Oh. We can catch a Pokemon first, feasibly. Okay, uh, what is... Wh who, who should we catch with? Probably, uh... Might actually be with, uh, Beautifly, since you can Feather Dance and make them less dangerous. So... Okay, let's... Please give me a good Pokemon. Please give me a good Pokemon. I need something that can help out. I've got a Beautifly and an Exploud right now, dude. I just want to see something decent. Show me something good. Show me something decent or good. Actually, all I need is decent. I don't even need good. I will settle for decent. I'm going to use the white flute since this is taking forever. Oh. We'll be lured for, like, the near future? What is going on? Can I find a Pokemon? Or am I cursed to use Beautifly for the rest of my life? What is going on? What was that? <laughs> Another friggin' bug Pokemon, dude! What the heck? I'm a bug catcher! I'm, I'm like a shitty bug catcher! Oh my lord. It's got mirror coat. I can't even afford to peck, because if I crit with a peck, it'll die. So I have to get it like one HP at a time with Leech Life. Oh God, dude. It has Leech Life too. Shoot me in the head, dude. Oh my God. It's got Mirror Coat and Friggin' leech life, dude. There's the crit that would have been horrible. Alright. We're gonna get to the Elite Four solely trying to get a decent Pokemon. Wanna restart? Nope. Dude, we're playing with this. We're playing against the harder version of this game with these Pokemon, dude. Astonish, okay. Ghost. We got ghost coverage on Ariados, dude. Come on, dude. Don't don't do don't do me like this, dude. I can't handle this right now. My brain my sanity cannot handle me not catching this Ariados. I cannot handle this. I cannot handle this. I'm going to lose my mind. I can't risk leech lifing because if I leech life and I crit, it dies. Catch 
watch the Ariados, dude. It can't have a. It can't have this high a catch rate, dude. All right, we gotta try. Little lower. Wait, is dive ball? No. That's I'm thinking of net ball that works better on bug Pokemon. Here we go, here we go. How is this happening? It's a bug. It's a shitty bug. How have I not caught it? What is going on? What is going on? Oh, catch the freaking Pokemon, dude. Catch the Ariados. How? Okay, okay, okay. What? What is happening? What is happening? Don't crit this. Just don't crit right now. Just don't. Okay. 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 Okay, guys, it's the Premier Ball. I guarantee this is gonna catch this, 100%. It will catch this Ariados. I would guarantee it so hard that fucking shit, how is this possible? How is it possible? How is it happening? I don't understand how it's happening. Okay, yeah, we'll just uh, throw a little Pokeball here at this Ariados here, um, real quick. No worries, this, this probably won't catch it. It probably won't catch it. It probably won't catch it. It's not gonna. Fuck! I I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. How? How? <laughs> what? What have I done? What have I done? Please, please. Thank God. We managed to catch the Ariados, dude. Its feet are tipped with tiny hooked claws that enable it to scuttle on ceilings and vertical walls. Ah yes, that thing that everybody's always talking about. Vertical walls. It constricts its foe with thin and strong silk webbing. Ah. <sighs> I, I, that, that was insane. That was, that was insane. I don't, I don't, uh, I don't, uh, sunk cost? All right. That was nuts. No worries. That's easy. All right. Uh, go ahead and hit okay on that. Great. And we're doing great, guys. We're in great mood right now. Uh, we are, this run is going swimmingly, I would say. Uh, we have a bug poison type now uh, that has leech life, uh, spider web, astonish, and mirror coat. So now we have a 30 power move between our two bug types. Uh, we have a 20, a 20, a 30, and a 35. Uh, it has 11 speed uh, and 16 attack, which is not horrible. Um, of course, our beautify, which is twice as high level, has just nine more attack. So um, we got a great team. Um, and we're gonna do really good here. We're gonna, this is definitely the run, guys. And we're, we're pumped about how, uh, how well it's going. Um, and we're also pumped about, uh, just like the Pokemon we have, um, the moves they have, uh, everything is just really coming together. It's all, it's all coming together nice and, nice and clean. Oh, let me just show you for anybody who missed, uh, uh, I missed what happened earlier. Uh, the Pokemon that we lost so far on this run. Um, I think, if I'm remembering correctly, I would prefer every single one of them to all of the Pokemon I have right now. <laughs> so we lost a uh, Camerupt uh, named Twin Peaks. We lost a Walrein named Murderer. We lost our Electrike named Sparkbark and our Ivysaur named Bulbafet. So, uh, 
Uh, this is this is uh, uh, where we are right now. Uh, we ran into a Dragonair that had Dragon Rage and swept most of our team. Uh, but you know, you just got to keep 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 on keeping on, you know. And to that end, we're gonna put Boombox up front, uh, and we're gonna go ahead and try to get a strong Pokemon. Is what we're gonna try to do. A ball toy. Would have loved to have the ball toy instead of the uh, instead of the Ariados. I'll tell you that much. But uh, can't always get what you want, folks. Can't always get what you want. So we're just gonna blow him up instead. Uh... That's cool. I do like that. Um. And I think I, uh, no, I'm leaving the self, Silk Scarf on Boombox. I don't know how strong these trainers are yet. <sighs> don't have like a, don't have like a Dragonite, dude. I, I just, okay, Stantler, level eight Stantler I can handle. Heck, even, even Beautifly might be able to handle that. I can handle this Pokemon. I can uh, Karate Chop this Pokemon, take it down. Done and done. Bug catcher versus bug catcher, yeah. Boombox is gonna carry us. Uh, have I already lost more than this run than the last run? Um, almost as many. I think we lost five the entirety of the last run. We should train sunk cost. No, yeah, probably. Um, probably. I guess we could put sunk cost out against these wild Pokemon and train them using Boombox, right? Get some cost like a couple levels here. Just get like a couple levels. I guess I could switch to Flyconic if it's an Ariados. And then I could peck it, and then that kills two birds with one stone. The animator for Tri Attack really went above and beyond. Yeah, absolutely. Said, I'm gonna get those freaking three elements in there, dude. Yeah, three Pokemon, two bugs, dude. Really, uh... Alright. Alright, Flyconic. I see you. Getting a kill there. Training our uh, sunk cost there. Won't lose, m learn moves for the for a long time for the same reason as Flyconic. I know that the um, evolved forms do learn a muck! I'm glad it's not level 150, huh, folks? Uh, sunk cost is out there. Let's get our uh, boombox on in there. If all forms do learn, uh, what's crazy to me, Phil, is you purposely chose this team. Boombox loves to get poison, folks. I should really teach Boombox refresh uh, based on his uh, history of getting poisoned. The time for bugs is now. That'll be good experience, though. Sunk cost will level up there. Get a nice couple attack. Boombox loves poison, dude. And I have to use an antidote, because we are in the grass. 6, 11, 17, and 25. Okay. So not for a little while, huh? We'll get we'll get Ariados to, like, level 8 or 9 or 10, maybe. I guess maybe 11. I would get poisoned as well if I was on this team. Love Disc! Okay, I think Ariados should be able to handle Love Disc, right? Love Disc stinks. Let's astonish the old. Love Disc with Present is wrecking us. Leech Life? Leech Life should do about the same amount of damage. I'll drain here. I... An unlucky crit would kill us. I'm, I appreciate that, King Name Paul. Uh, I appreciate that. I'm glad. I'm. I'm glad that this is good content. Uh, on account of my team is the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. My team, team hurts me that I'm using it. On the other hand, if we end up beating the Elite Four, 
with an Ariados and a Beautifly. That's uh, certainly something. Uh, don't let anything happen. Uh, you have to take your dog out. Uh, well, we started around two, so we're coming up on the end of the stream probably relatively soon. Leech Life should be able to uh, do some decent damage to him. He's psychic. Stab bonus, super effective. There you go. Drain some health. Get back up to 24, dude. Mud Sport. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Another love disc. Pretty much can't. Uh, can't fight that. Oh, it's so painful. <laughs> Switching out against wild love discs, dude. Oh my god. It hurts my pride to switch against a wild love disc. Okay. I'm just gonna go heal real quick. And then I think we're going to try to fight another trainer. He only had level 8 Pokemon, so I think we can train sunk cost on a trainer at this point. Very nice try, Sirhan. Sunk cost is leveling pretty quick. Yeah, uh, I, I don't know if that will stay happening, you know? That might just be because sunk cost is a low level right now. What do we got? That's bugs. Send out something bad, youngster Joey. Fan pee, we could we can handle a fan pee, dude. I was ready for youngster Joey to bust out the Rayquaz. Fan pee, my beloved. Try attack, baby. Nice miss, nice miss. Love to see it. A vine whip from a fampy. That's very cute. Uh, two misses. All right, all right. And that's three misses. All right, all right. That's Sonic Boom, which always does 20 HP damage. And now we finally hit a try attack. Uh, we did survive against the fampy. That was seven levels uh, lower. It'd be so funny if a Rayquaza showed up and swept you after you power leveled Booty Fly for an hour. Uh, I thought Explod was immune to sound attacks. I guess Sonic Boom doesn't count as a sound attack? Because I also thought that. Yeah, avoid sound based moves. I don't know what. Uh, I don't know what counts as a sound based move if it's not Sonic Boom. Oh man, what a run, dude, so far. This is, uh, something. I'll tell you that much. It is something. It would be the main sound based attack. You would think so, right? Nice, we can get some experience for our Flyconic here. Could just be air, yeah. Could just be like flying past something and then like the physical Sonic. What the heck, dude? You're gonna do seven damage to me. And then you're gonna leech my life. Two crits in one fight. What, did I roll the worst luck number of all time? I, I, I can't believe this. What is going on in this game right now? All right, Ariados getting some decent attack there. 
Um, let's give uh, an Orin Berry to Flyconic. I study at school, and I study on the way home, too. Okay, nerd. Nerd! Nerd alert! Studying all the time. What the fuck? Oh my god! Oh, sorry, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I was kidding. I was kidding. Oh. Okay. Level 9? We should be good, right? Alright, using Foresight, no worries on that. Thanks for using Foresight. Let's just take him down right now. This little girl got a Groudon. Yeah, let's uh, go ahead and just eliminate that Groudon real quick. Let's not, uh, just one-hit shot him. Let's go, Boombox. Do, do your job. Oh, no, not Mud Slap. I don't want to see Mud Slap right now. Uh, luckily, though, um, the good news about Mud Slap is it means less likely to have a powerful attack. And we did hit it, guys. We took down the Groudon. That would have uh, really stunk, I gotta tell you, losing to a uh, schoolgirl with a Groudon. Uh... That would have sucked. Uh, all right. Um, so we didn't die. It's good news. Okay, let's go ahead and fight just one at a time here. I'm not. Uh, I'm not gonna go ahead and get unlucky here with uh, double battle. Just not in the cards. Youngster Johnson. <laughs> a child named Johnson. Um. Astonish him, so he flinches. Flinch him. Hey, flinch him. Flinch him. Ah. Flinch him. Milk drink? This dude's got a freaking competitive squad. He's got a tank with milk drink, dude. What did he do, like, egg training to get that slow bro, that milk drink? All right, leech life for the kill, because it's super effective. Yeah, whose milk is he drinking, dude? What's he bringing some extreme chocolate milk around with him? Okay. <laughs> what, what is this shit? What is this shit? Oh my god, dude. Poison gas? Are you kidding me? A 55% poison ability? There's plenty of decent poison moves. What is this? Crap. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> well, we'll get rid of spider web because we're never using spider web, but uh Yeah, I toggled the terrible RNG switch when I started the game. Let's get that poison gas ability, dude. Toxic has 30% better chance to hit, and it's badly poisoned them. Alright, sunk cost is popping off though, dude. Sunk cost is getting that friggin' experience, dude. He's he's or she's uh, absolutely going huge against this uh, feller. You're gonna see Abernex and be mad at losing spider web. Well, he won't have teleport, so no worries. On that. <clears throat> All right, 126. That was fun, even though I lost. That's very healthy, youngster Johnson. If the tunnel doesn't go through, then I'll just go over the top. See Entei next. Can't! Can't find him in the wild, Carly. Sorry, sorry to step on that. It's just, it's, it's not possible. 
Um, let's go for it, baby. Poison gas! Hey, connected with the poison gas, dude. On the weird looking war turtle. This war turtle looks a little bit like, like a hammer, bro. You know? All right, now we're gonna try to astonish and, and just uh, go ahead and make him flinch. Get him with the flinches, get him with the poison. This is the move, dude. Okay, astonish him again. One more flinch and we got him. <laughs> okay, that's fine. We'll just get Flyconic a little bit of that War Turtle experience. Sunk cost, more like chip damage. One sec. All right, Hiker Clark. Took him down, dude. Are we hurt yet? Or is sunk cost kind of popping off? Sunk cost attacks at 27 now. Has already passed uh, Beautifly's attack. Catching up to Explode as well. Sunk cost is not as horrible as we might have thought. Uh, PB&J, I've got some very bad news for you. It's much worse than you think, as well. We can catch another Pokemon in the cave, you're absolutely right. We're all so tired. I should have never come back. I need to buy more Pokeballs, don't I? Oh, I need to give somebody an amulet coin. I've, I've been wasting money here. Also, uh, Murderer is in Hell, and uh, obviously Twin Peaks, and then also uh, our uh, Spark Bark. Flyconic did survive, unfortunately. A Dragonair whipped out its uh, Dragon Rage ability on us, and... It was not great. This guy just said the word roar. Um, is Phil going to put up clown on clown makeup and become the Joker? The answer is maybe. Uh, Boombox and Sunk Cost are going to do a du dual battle because at this point, guys, if they can't team up to beat these... Uh, I've never once been bested by anyone at anything. So tell me, why when these trainers are staring directly at each other have they not battled? Because isn't that the rules? Alright, oh no, not another dragon Pokemon, please no. Not this shit, not this shit dude, not this shit dude. Try to make him flinch and try attack him immediately. He's level eight, we should be able to kill him. Okay. Big money. Oh, I forgot to do the amulet coin. Stupid of me. Okay, so we'll flinch him maybe. Well, we'll attack him at least. Another astonish on him and a try attack on Apom. Absolute noob. Sunk cost, same level as Beautifly now. Pure outclassing. With <laughs> a Golbat, okay. That could be a bad news bears situation for us. Pin missile, that will not be a bad news bears situation for us. Oh baby god killer, yeah. Uh, Boombox is, is starting to get kind of strong. A 
Let's just leech life it, get one HP back, and then try attack. The gold bat should be fine. Wow! Was not expecting that, I gotta tell ya. Was not expecting the full restore on the level 8 Anorith. Oh, Anorith is the baby god killer. True, 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 Rich people bust out the items, apparently. That's how Sunk Cost gets that health back. And Anorith is a dunzo, folks. This is a new experience for me. Oh, baby, say it isn't so. Yeah, classic rich kid. Oh, baby, say it isn't so. A black belt. All right, I'll take a black belt, dude. All right. Get some more here. So here is something where you have to fight them in a dual battle, right? Oh, no, you, you could do a single battle if you want. But it's complicated, so let's do it, baby! Dual battle's actually probably better because you have to get really unlucky for them both to have a busted Pokemon. Whereas in a, in a single battle, uh, if you run into a tough... Thank God we're overleveled, dude. I mean... Dang, <laughs> that's nuts. I gotta stop talking. You're absolutely right, D-Storm. I mean, it's just, it's nuts. Thank God Boombox has Tri-Attack and like Silk Scarf and everything because it is really helping. Okay. What's he gonna do? Conversion, all right. I know you said sanity was randomized, but it feels not so random, to be honest. Get a nice karate chop in on that Snorlax. Yeah, I love the Oddish family. Great designs. I slacked off in school, that's why I lost. Oh, he's beating himself up, dude. We're slacking off in school, I hate that. It's not the lesson I wanted him to learn, I just wanted him to learn that he sucks at Pokemon. All right. A revive, you say, all right. I'll take a revive. 750 money. No commentary, just pain. Yeah, I just don't, I just don't talk, I just sit here, just my face goes and then. Is there a risk you'll just get wrecked by an errant self-destruct? Yep. I don't know how strict the um, you learn more powerful moves later thing is. Um, I don't know if it's purely strict, because if it is, then that means self-destruct and explosion will be the last move people could possibly learn. Um, Knew it. Knew it, dude. Nice cleanse tag. They really do, Staticus. And they are. It's just they're barfing money. What do you got to say? Pico and I, when we were jumped by an odd thug, he made off with my... Dude, another dude is saying roar? What is with all the people saying roar out loud? Yeah, I, I'm going to get more Pokeballs. I'm just checking for items here. This is the hidden power or whatever. Secret power thing. We are just treading water.
All right, let's get 10 Pokeballs. And then let's get 10 more Pokeballs. Toon is definitely a bop. It also reminds me of the Mario series a lot. Oh! Shahan, oh no. When you did the one with 20 seconds, I was like, to be honest, I'm gonna, t I'm gonna say those combined, you did it perfectly. Because it was one shot, second shy, and then one second over, so. You know, you can consider it two victories if you want, instead of uh, the opposite. <clears throat> a muck! Would love to catch a muck right about now. <laughs> Instead of uh, two dismal fa Oh, I didn't even sit in the friggin' Poke Center. I need to go back to do that because I have very little PP on my moves. <laughs> PP. Little PP. Alright, um, try attack. Don't run a battle. Thank you. All right, here we go, folks. Gonna heal up. Lyconic gets reincarnated in another run. Are you are you just strictly betting against me right now in this next cave? Oof, dude. I'm trying not to think about losing a wall rain and an ivy sore. The the electric dog, it's like all right. But a wall rain and an ivy sore did. All right. Uh, Flyconic goes up front because of uh, Feather Dance. Favorite Gen three Pokemon is unfortunately it's Kyogre. All right. Folks, the only Pokemon we can catch in Rust Turf Tunnel is to Meowth. All right. Feather dance that feller. Go ahead and leech life him. I don't even believe it. I don't even believe it. I just, I, I don't even, I don't even fucking, how the fuck is it fucking? All right, guys. Well, thank you for joining today. Uh, I think that's a good time to wrap up the stream. Uh, <laughs> we'll stream again next week, uh, either Sunday or this Thursday. We'll continue playing Pokemon. On Tuesday, we'll get back to uh, Oblivion. We'll be playing both of those runs for a little while as we are getting close to the end of Oblivion. Uh, but you know, let's get a quick save on that, and uh, that's where we'll, where we'll pick up for next time, folks. Uh, thank you very much for joining. I do appreciate it. Even though the the fucking run itself was pretty painful, I had a good time. Uh. I enjoy the added challenge very much. Uh, let's go find somebody to raid, folks. Uh, 